you say no thanks? What the fu- why would you say that? Do you say no thanks? No thanks. No thanks. I'm full, Brendan. Brendan, I'm sorry. I had a I had a big dinner today. I can't watch the stream. I Brendan, I'm so fucking sorry, Brendan. I had a big dinner today. I can't watch the stream on account of my large meal. Yeah. <laughs> Brendan, I'm freaking sorry, but because of my large meal from earlier, I just, no thanks, no. Couldn't possibly. No, thank you. No, thanks. I get it, I get it, I get it. Hi. I'm feeling a bit better today. Uh, still a little iffy. I have I have some cough drops. I have these. These are supposed to help. But yeah, feeling normal-ish. You're gonna heal. You're gonna hear me marbling around in my mouth with some yummy, yummy vitamin C. How are the smoker lungs? I mean, I got the fucking, I got the patch on, and I'm also nicotine lozenges. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, uh, five days into no vaping. Um, I hate it, but uh, I'll get over it. You know. As was foretold, you're going to hear like the, you're going to get some premium cough drop clacking around on my teeth kind of vibe. Have you ever considered just not wanting to vape? I mean, yeah, that's what I'm trying to do. Duh, idiot. Fucking, I'm going to fucking smash you into a goddamn fucking manhole. They're going to find your body parts in the sewers, bub. Say that you slept with his mom. Hey, hey, Chad. Me and your mom were talking. We were having um a little a little apartif, uh, a little uh, a little appetizer at the Applebee's. They call them appetizers. They're pretty good. Uh, anyway, Chad. Me and your mom. It wasn't a date. It was just supposed to be a business yeah. meeting between me and her, talking about yeah. the future of the chat here on the Daniel Twitch channel. Um, but then she grabbed a mozzarella stick at the same time that I did, and so we decided to do like a Lady in the Tramp bit, where your mom bit into half of the mozzarella stick, and I bit into the other half, and we let the cheese get ooey and gooey in the middle. And suffice it to say, I'm your dad now. I'm sorry. And if you got two dads, you got three dads now. So. Thank you, Germ the 23rd, for the tier one sub. Did you clack teeth with my mother? I did. I opened up your mom's mouth, and then I touched the, my two front teeth to your mom's two front teeth. As was foretold. Uh, you're cheating on Shelby? I'm not cheating on Shelby. I got permission to fuck your mom. What am I, some kind of simple streamer who's going to be like, I'll cheat on my wife to fuck your mom? No, I got a pink slip for my wife to fuck your mom. I got permission to fuck your mom. Brendan, this is ridiculous. My mom is lactose intolerant. I'm sorry. It was a vegan mozzarella stick. No real cheese. It was a uh, soy cheese. You now have a new dad. I was listening to that song earlier. Uh, let me see. Is my shit on right? All right. My shit's on right. What my audio doing? We doing all right? We're not doing fucking crazy audio today. I also have throat spray just in case. I'm like all prepped and ready because I feel like a lot of the throat, a lot of the sore throat stuff is psychosomatic. So I'm going to power through it and be stronger than, uh, th than that. <laughs> oh. Well, I had two dads and it's in the process of going down to one, but maybe I'll have three dads for a few days. <laughs> The dads are going through a divorce. I'm so sorry. 
Have you pissed yet today? Yeah, it was uh, it was neon green. It was the color of nightmares. It was the stuff of legend. Uh, all right, video scam. Am I face up here? No, okay. Where's the PS2 game overlay? There it is. Oh, video input capture is also. There we go. Did you taste it? No. What a freak question. Star Wars! Mr. Beast! Uh, oh, I forgot. Oh, is today St. Patty's Day? Oh, wait a minute. Is today St. Patrick's Day? Because, like, that's the one. I think that and Arbor Day are the two. Uh, they're like the two holidays that I don't remember. Yes, it is St. Patty's Day. Oh, shit. All right. Can't pinch me. In the game, I'm wearing green. You can't pinch me. I'm wearing green in the game. You can't pinch me. You can't do it. I'm the jonkler. I'm wearing green. I'm eating. Oh, I'm big pizza. Oh. Oh, give me a slice. I'm jonkling. Don't fuck with me. I'll fucking get you. Remember, I can do that at any point in time. I can just... I can fucking get you. Hello, Batman. Are you ready for... Batman, no green on St. Patty's Day. <laughs> I'll give you a little bitch. My stink hole itches, but I ran out of chapstick. Any suggestions? Yeah. Bye a bidet. Bye a bidet. I know you're looking for sillies and jonkles, and I know you're looking to get on the fridge. Bye a bidet. No. I'm not going to be faced by that. Bye a bidet. It shoots a bunch of water pressure up your asshole and gets it nice and clean. Yeah. Bye a bidet. You can get a bidet for like 80 bucks on Amazon. Uh, some of the cheaper ones are like $40. Uh, but also, if you get like swamp ass from sitting in your gamer seat all day, get some baby powder. Puff that up there. Get a little puff puff up there. If you're worried about it, get a little puff puff up there. Don't worry about like an enema or anything. Just get a little puff up there. Do some butt kegels. Get a buff butt. And then when your butt gets sweaty, get a, get a butt buff puff. Uh, yeah. I'm back on my shit. Yeah. I'm back on that grind. Yeah. Enemas are actually cool. Enemas are like a, a Tetris line clear, but for your butthole. A power washer does the same on top of washing my car. Well, yeah, but like, then you're going to have to like either snake the hose inside or like power wash your asshole out of the front lawn. And either way, like both are going to be a miserable experience. Honestly, do a little Kegel work. If you do enough Kegels um, with, like, your butthole, like, enough butthole Kegels, do you think that you'd be able to poop, like, the spaghetti Play-Doh machine from when we were kids? You know, the one that would, like, shoot out a thin, long string of spaghetti? Do you think you can tighten your sphincter to the point where, like, you poo out one long spaghetti string of poo? Or do you think that's, like, a myth? That's not gonna happen. That's not possible. Chat, do you believe in dreams? Or do you believe in nightmares? Chat, do you believe in dreams? Do you believe in the... the consistence of humanity? A man can dream, chat. A man can dream. I believe in the sauce. Me looking at ketchup, I should pray. <laughs> Looking at a bottle of barbecue, I, you know what? I should pray, actually. Right? Nope. This is the perfect time. I should pray. Uh, I'll keep the auto frenzy, sure. Oh, they're gone over here. Uh, I'll take the Warforged. Sphincter, sphincter so tight they call me the Castrator. Don't see men no more. I'm a chronic masturbator. Would that be the second line? Somebody threw out like a little rhyme for me. Yeah, the father, the spirit, and the sweet baby Ray. 
I believe in lacing my milk with honey. Dude, I had a tea with honey yesterday. It was fucking, it was divine. Today? No, today is hell. Speaking of dreams, have you played dreams? Oh, like the PS4 dreams? Yeah. I mean, I played it before. I, I, like, it's fine. I can hook it up anytime I want, uh, because I have the PS4, but also, like, it's fine. Oh, God damn it! I'm gonna do sh shit hits. They took my car. Finish this fight. Damn, son of a bitch. Come on, one shot. Never gonna happen. Hi, Bubby. Bubby's down here with me today. Just so you know. So I may have to step away to clean up either throw up or to deal with her hissing and growling. They stole my fucking Jonkler mobile and now I have nothing left. They took the fucking Jonkler meal. I don't know why I said the Jonkler meal. They took the fucking, they took the fucking Jonkler meal. I'm sorry. They took the Jonkler meal. <laughs> I meant the Jonkler mobile. They took my fucking Jonkler meal. I was at the Burger King getting the new Batman and Jonkler meal. Horrible, but they took it. Hi, Bobby. Look, Bobby. <laughs> Hi. It's Bobby. She's so upset. She's so upset. They took my fucking Jonkler meal. They took it away from me. McDonald's Jonkler meal. They took it from me. I was going to get those crazy chicken tenders. I was going to get those zany fries. I was going to get the Jonkle shake. They took it all from me. They said no more. We're sick of your shit, Brendan. No more Jonkle. No more Jonkle snake. <laughs> fucking losing it. I can't keep a coherent sentence together. I'm fucking losing it. No more Jonkle Snake. What does Fortnite Joker do to Frieza pose? I don't know. What do the Jonkle meal consist of? I'm thinking like a... You know how like they make a... They make a big pasta? What is a big pasta called? Manicotti? Like one big manicotti fried? And then, uh, three loose french fries that rattle around in the bag. So, like, just one really big manicotti, which is like a pasta filled with cheese. And then three loose french fries. Some may say every Jonkle meal is, um, personally approved by the Jonkler, but I, uh, I disagree, actually. Humongo cotti. Manicotti. Give that man a big manicotti. All right, let's get my ass kicked again. I gotta, like, wake up here. I gotta, like, wake up and get back into the Fortnite sauce. Every Jonkle meal is personalized. Every Jonkle meal is ribbed for your pleasure. It's just a McRib. That's, like, the tagline for the Jonkle meal. It's gonna be, every meal is ribbed for your pleasure, but it's just a McRib. It's a McRib and three used condoms. And he's like, we live in a society. It comes with a toy. It's just a little Joker toy that says, we live in a society, and it sprays you with gas. Every meal is McRibbed for your pleasure. This is true. When are they going to bring the McRib back again? I'm looking for that, like, disgusting steez. I'm looking to pick up some delicio steez from the McDonald's. I need, I need a McRib. Used by who? I don't know. They come prepackaged. You check it out, it's applesauce. It's not even cum. Holy shit, condom full of applesauce. You thought they were used. It's just white applesauce. I'm stupid. I'm stupid. I'm dumb. I'm stupid. I only have the one gun. It's not even come. It's not even come. It's going to be applesauce. Three condoms full of applesauce and a big manicotti. The last time they brought it back, it was the last. It's not coming back. Yeah, but they said that four times now. Hi, Bubby. Are you growling? You going to throw up? Hi. She's yelling again. She's just, she's just, what? Basically, we're trying to swap the cats for like two hours a day. Uh, so, like, Bubby will come down here. She'll growl and scream. And then, like, I don't know, maybe throw up. So I have cleaning supplies down here in case it happens. But we're trying to, we're trying to get them used to each other's smells. So Beals is upstairs and Bubby is down here. 
How long has it been since Bubby has been on stream? A while, because we kept him separated, because they keep fighting. So now we're trying the no eye contact. They cannot see each other. We are going to swap them intermittently uh, through upstairs and downstairs. I think it's a good idea. I think it's best for the both of them. We're just going to have to do a really, really soft um, integration for them. Because after they fought, I need them to make sure that they know that, like, hey, I want to be able to open the basement door. I want to have both cats down here. You don't got to cuddle. You don't got to be friends. Just don't fight. All I care about is they don't got to cuddle. They don't got to be friends. They don't got... As long as they don't fight, I am happy. And it's like, they can, they can do play fighting, right? Play fighting is fine. Uh, but no drawing blood. And that shit's not flying again. Do you put a hood over their heads to transport them upstairs to downstairs? No. No, the way we do it is uh, I put um, the, Bubby in the bathroom upstairs. And then I come downstairs, I get Beals, and I put her in the bedroom upstairs. Then I grab Bubby out of the bathroom and bring her down here. And then my wife lets Beals out of the bedroom. Hi, baby. She's just howling and yowling. She got a lot of cat jowling. I also, uh, I'm gonna blame any bad performance I had on I just got done doing a bunch of dishes, so my hands are a little wet. Not even wet, like, they're not wet, they're dry, but like, you know, the, like, the after, after wetness where nothing feels right for, like, 20 minutes after you get your hands wet? I don't know if anybody else has that, like, weird sensory issue where, like, your hands are wet and now they feel like they're made of paper. So you gotta wait, like, 20 minutes for them to realign with your chakra and have the chi flowing through you properly instead of negatively. My chi! My fucking chi! My chi is unaligned. I'm trying to play Fortnite and realign my chi. Not necessarily like the wrinkles, but like just the, the the sheer vibe of like, I'm going to fucking die. My hands are fucking dry. They need to be wet again. I need to mo re moisten my hands. Hey, fucker. Are you outside? Or are you inside? Oh, shit. You were solid snake. Now you're solid. Baked. Got him. Gotta get some more yellow bile in you. Listen, I, I quit vaping uh, five days ago. And I will tell you, nobody fucking told me that, A, your throat would hurt because I've quit vaping before for like a month. Um, and then I had a family member pass away and I fell right back into it. But I, I've quit vaping before and I've never had like this sore throat issue. Oh shit. Jesus. I have bad reaction time. <sighs> So, like, I didn't know, I did not know that, like, you were going to, A, I knew I was going to expel yellow bile, because I've been expelling a lot of yellow bile, but I did not know that it was going to involve, like, a sore throat. Right? I never, I never knew that. I never knew. I had no idea. Like, clammy? Yeah, like, clammy hands. Oh, my sensitivity might also be fucked up, so... Are you certain the throat is related? Could just be sick. No, it's related. It's not a sickness either. With a sick sore throat, it never like comes and goes. With a sick sore throat, uh, it's just there and you have to deal with it. With uh, with a dropping nicotine sore throat or dropping a uh, vaping or smoking sore throat, um, it comes and goes. Hi, Bobby. Hi, Bobby. Hi. Hi. She a good girl. Hi, baby. She a good girl. You got any throat sweets? No, I have. I have. Um. Yeah. I have lozenges. Yeah. I have two different kinds of lozenges. Yeah. Thank you, Salamander32, for the tier one sub. Just means your humors are out of, out of balance. I what, How can my humors be out of balance if I've never been funny? How can you... <laughs> Gotta be funny to have humors, but I'm tiss. A few friends quit smoking, vaping, and none of them mentioned sore throat. Well, yeah, because, like, the first time I quit, I didn't have a sore throat. I 
I didn't have a sore throat the first time I quit. Uh, it was after. Brendan, will you be wearing green short shorts this stream? Maybe green screen the game to your corn cutter in them? No. No, thank you. Nice try. That was a good fridge attempt, um, but it was too hard. You tried too hard. I'm sorry, like, sex things? They're not gonna get you on the fridge. You're not gonna get on the fridge by saying vile, like, awful sex things. It's about stunlocking the streamer. Hi, Bubby. She's yelling again. Oh, she do be screaming. Oh, shit. Oop. We're fine. We're fine. I have dog shit weapon. We're fine. I gotta get used to the game again. Gotta remember how to play. Gotta do my Fortnite warm uppies. Uh, take that. Everybody here. Gotcha. Oh. Me when I, then when I. Were you, you weren't, you weren't even real. Football day? Everybody loved football day. Yeah. Oh, thank you, Count Dracula, for the sub, prime sub. You'll never get my pot of gold. M. Night Shyamalan should have a Leprechaun movie called Pot of Old, and it should be a sequel to Old, but instead it's actually a part of the Leprechaun cinematic universe, and when you find the Leprechaun's Pot of Gold, it just makes you old. That'd be a good bit, I think. Pot of Old. I love the idea of Pot of Old. Print it, sell it, make a million, make a bazillion dollars. Print it, sell it, make a grazillion dollars. Hi, Bobby. You're yelling again? I hate old? Yeah. You'll never get me pot of old. Hi, Bobby. Come here. Gotcha. Ooh, sorry. Hi, Bubby. She's fucking- she is- she is geeking out hard style, ain't she? She's going zany mode. Bubby and Beal's finally getting along? No, we have them separated. I- uh, I just brought Bubby down here. We're just swapping them. We're doing- we're doing cat swap, so Beal's is the upstairs cat, Bubby is the downstairs cat. We're doing cat swap live! Bring me your cat! Do it! I dare you to bring your cat to my house! We're swapping them! In, I am taking your cat. You will not have a cat. Cat swap. It's where I take your cat, and then you get, uh, I'll give you slime. You want slime? I got slime. Oh, I want my precious little puddin'. I want my precious little puddin'. I don't want slime, Brendan. Sorry, you get slime. Apologies. I'm gonna give you slime. So fucking sorry. Bubby, I swear to God, if you don't chill, I'm gonna give you slime. Hi. Hi, Bubby, I love you. Hi, Bubby, I love you. The challenge the dog, man. He'd be out here dubious barking. Kerberos dog, man. Hello. Hello, dog. Hello, dog, man. Hello, dogs. Even I fight that dog, man. Really? Out here fighting the dog daddy? I'm reloading, chill. I want the funny token. Give me the funny token, Bobby. Bobby. Yelling isn't gonna get you back upstairs, girl. When will you learn, Bobby? Yeah, she'll chill down a little bit. It's just one of those things where it's like, man, it sucks that I gotta keep her down here because she hates being down here. Somebody firing upon me. Why did you fire upon me like that? You're so silly. Oh, thank you, Chipples, for the five gift subs. Wow. I appreciate that. Look at that fat loot. Is she scared of being in the other girl's territory? Yeah, it's just one of those things where, like, she's afraid of being down here, um, because she's afraid of Beals, so... 
It's it's the only thing we can do, and it sucks, and I hate doing it to her because she's such a cute little girl. But it's the it's the only thing that's going to work is a good cat swap. And she's gonna be mad because we're gonna be doing multiples of them. So, but the second she calms down, and the more that she calms down while she's down here, the more likely we are to let them both roam the whole house. Gamer lube? Yeah, I'm getting that gamer lube hard yeah. style, dude. I'm covering myself in viscous fluid to make me shoot the gun the fast. I've always wanted to see you slime a mod. I just saw that. I <laughs> I can't wait for the day when I finally wake up and there's a mod outside of my home and my precariously placed bucket of slime is oh so ripe. Oh so ripe to drop onto a mod. You should get a third cat for them to both hate so they can unite against a single enemy. <laughs> You're insane. What mod would you slime if you could? Uh, Rock Distributor first, followed by Metaru, followed by the rest of them. It, it depends on how the frequency of, of being here as a mod. So, everybody else, meh. Like, they'll get slimed inevitably, but like... First Rock, then Metaru, then everybody else. And it's, it's a little bit less slime each time. I have a chance to escape. Oh, no. No, you're going to be in the locked slime room. I'm sorry. You're locked away in the fucking slime tower, dude. They're not going to be able to get you out of there until you're done. Fuck you. Yeah, I mean, Roach can be like eighth. Actually, no, we're not sliming Roach. Roach, does, Roach doesn't deserve any slime. Roach gets no slime, actually. This is true. This is true. Thank you, Alistair Salem, for the tier one yeah. sub! Yeah. I appreciate that. Thank you for the gift sub. I'm gonna fucking get my ass kicked here. Watch me fucking get owned. Watch me whip a nana my way into fucking nightmares. Where are they? Yeah. Are they out? Oh, yeah. are they up? Am yeah. I stupid? Oh shit, they were a better shot. Damn. It happens. You're so silly, Brendan. I'm really silly, Corey. Yeah. What would you do if they added you to Fortnite? I'd be like, why would you add somebody so terrible to the fucking game? I'd be like, why would you add me? I'm so fucking bad at the game. Like, what the hell? Also, thank you, uh, Codeman Birdie for the tier one sub. I missed that one. I was talking. You can stop dying if you play Battleborn. Randy Pitchford's famous video game, Battleborn. If you could add one emote to Fortnite, what would it be? I think there should be an emote where Raven Team Leader it takes off her pants and then she fucking farts. Farts. <laughs> Me too. Adjusting, we're readjusting. We're readjusting. We're readjusting. I love readjusting. I love readjusting. Um, they hit opponents with different weapon types, travel in the air while in a vehicle. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my vile humors. Oh, oh, oh my vile humors. Go to the gay station. I'm gonna get a Fago.
I'm dying. I need a medic bag. Oh, God. Oh, uh, don't mind me. A lot of poison leaving my body, so. Oh, God. The other person ran away. There's somebody. Don't run away from me. You have a web hammer. Fight me. Don't run away from the jongler. What are you doing? Why are you hitting a rock? I love that the NPCs are, like, coded um, to just break random things whenever they're panicking because they're still, like, I don't think there's separate zero build bot rules, right? So I think in the in the bot brain that they have set up for, like, bots, they, they still want to break rocks and stuff to get materials that they can never have. They, they want materials for a build they will never have. Uh, give me some slime. Give me some sugar, baby. I'm um, being bounty hunted. Don't fucking come at me. Unless you're Dog the Bounty Hunter. I think if I committed a crime, it'd be at least cool to be on TV. Like, if Dog the Bounty Hunter comes after you for, like, unpaid parking tickets, like thousands of dollars worth of them, at least you get to be the guy on TV. You, uh, you, you go to debtor's prison, you go to jail, you pay your parking tickets, you get out of jail. You're like, hey, I'm a TV star. I was the guy who was arrested on Dog the Bounty Hunter, and I fell down the stairs and I split my pants and I farted right in front of him. You play build mode? For a second, I'm going to be honest, I thought you said bald mode. I'm going to be 100%. I definitely thought you said, will you play bald mode? No. <laughs> New Fortnite Battle Royale. Seasonal skin uh, seasonal skin festival. Every character is now bald. Bald characters get hair and then lose it in the lobby. Yeah, I'm playing Fortnite bald mode. Uh, you mean build mode? Nah, bald mode. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh, oh. Or is bald mode, is Fortnite bald mode where you start with a lot of hair and it counts as like your health? And you gotta like regrow your hair with Rogaine and shit? No, 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 I'm fucking dead and stupid and dumb. Oh, well, I'm dumb, I'm dumb. I switched to the wrong gun. I wasn't fast enough. Reaction time is bad. Is that the bald pe- Is that the noise bald people make? Is that the bald mating call? Me when I- <laughs> What are you doing, Brendan? I'm calling bald? <laughs> Brennan, what are you up to? I'm doing the bald call. <laughs> this bird is horrendous. This bird loves pizza. Ornithologists are getting really upset at me because I keep feeding the bird pizza. Ornithologists are so fucking angry at this one simple trick. Feed the bird pizza. He eat it through the neck hole. Eat more pizza. I'm feeding the bird pizza and you're not going to be able to stop me. I'm drawn to this noise. I'm sprinting towards Iowa. I tell you, everybody loves the bald call. It's where you it, you call the bald men immediately with a... Oh, oh. See, even Bubby. Bubby's not even bald and she's falling for it. I... Oh, she's so upset. She's so mad at me. Taking an ornithology class right now, you can actually give the birds a big pizza. This is fucked. Put your cat on the mic. No, she's all grumpy. I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't want to upset the like fucking grumpus. I'm not upsetting her. She's grumpy. Hi, Bobby. Hi. Look how grumpy she is. Bubby's so grumpy. Why did you upset her? Uh, because I brought Bubby downstairs and Beals is upstairs. I did a cat swap. I did a cat swap for a couple hours. That's why she's mad. It's because she's got to be in the other cat's territory. She's mad because the other cat is upstairs in her territory. Bubby is in I'm going to kill mode. 
Bobby Gumpy, Bobby Gumpy, Bobby Gumpy. Yeah, I was watching this streamer the other day, but man, hoof. Bobby Gumpy, what did you say? You said you're watching a streamer and Bobby Gumpy? Yeah, dude, he's playing Fortnite. Dude, Bobby Gumpy. What, what, can you speak English, please? I am speaking English, Bobby Gumpy. I do, dude, 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 you gotta stop watching this guy. You're, you're, you're transforming into a slug. I'm sorry, dude, but uh, Bobby Gumpy. Anyway, you want to hear the bald maiden call? Me like, <laughs> Hi, Bobby. Hi. 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 You're so squeamy. Brennan, why did you make a bra why did you break make a bracket emote? I don't know, I just wanted to. Cause I wanted to. Cause it kinda be like you chilling in the chat, you're about to grapple with me. You chilling in the chat? Why not have a bracket emote? You chilling in the chat? You wanna grapple with me? You wanna fucking grab me out of the dark corners and put me into your fucking little uh, bracken sacking? You're not real. It's okay. It's okay. I forgive you. You're not real. Brendan being able to do that mating call proves he's bald. No, it proves that I am on the pathhood to bald. I'm on the pathway to bald. But I am not bald yet. I am on the path to bald. But I'm not bald yet. What is Whack Donald's? I think that's like McDonald's anime sauce. They got an anime sauce now, right? I haven't had McDonald's in like a month, two months now. They got an anime sauce there, right? Where it's like a sweet and sour chili. I got the anime sauce there. No, that's what the Whack Donald's is. I think it's a reference to McDonald's being called Whack Donald's. You're not real. I think it's a reference to McDonald's being called like Whack Donald's in every permutation. Hey, Brendan, I don't know if you explained why you got the bracket emote. I got four ads in a row. Oh, I got the bracket emote because that way you can grapple with me. Hi, Bobby. Hi, Bobby. You yelling? What are you thinking about, Bobby? She's thinking about killing. The whole ad campaign is insufferable. I mean, all ad campaigns are insufferable. McDonald's is a marketing scheme by McDonald's to stop whack Donald's fair parody and things. The trade market is meaning so much. They, they trade market it, meaning so much paradoy is lost. Well, it really depends. Like, then you just call it, like, shit, fuck, poop, fart, Donald's. I don't know, has there been a lawsuit? Have they said that's the reason why? Or is this just like, you know, Fortnite Gooner meme speculation? It's like, part of me is like, yeah, I wouldn't put, put it past him for that. But also like, McDonald's is a US based corporation. Um, Whack Donald's is something referenced in a lot of anime, which is based in Japan. And I'm sure they don't want to get like, involved in a lengthy legal battle in Japan. Listen, I'm all, I'm all, I'm all for one when it comes to crazy corporate conspiracies. I, I love them, but also that one, that one is a little bit of a stretch in the butthole. They got the money for it? Yeah, I mean, probably, but also, like, you gotta remember, with a different legal system, you're gonna be embroiled in a lengthy legal battle against companies that are, uh, also quite big. It's like fucking, what is it? Um, didn't in JoJo's, in the sub of JoJo's, they have to subtitle the stands differently, but the characters will still say the name of the stands even if they're band names, right? I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna pretend to be a Japanese copyright lawyer to, or like try to figure out Japanese copyright law, but I would assume if anything, maybe it'd be changed in America in the actual subtitles, but past that, I don't, I don't see that being bi a big enough of a deal for them to make a, make a fuss about it. I think it's, I think it's, I think it's somebody at corporate who's like, dude, would do a crazy little wacky reference to the fact that everybody says whack Donald's in anime. Like, it's just a crazy little, little thing. Um, but if, if there's like an actual, like, lawsuit 
revealed, then I will definitely be like, yeah, wow, that is definitely a play for them to do that. I just don't believe that they... That's like... It's possible. I'm not going to say that it's unfeasible that McDonald's would do such a thing. I just say that it's incredibly unlikely that they would even waste time on something like that for just a promotion. I find that unlikely, not implausible entirely, but I, I don't think they would do a funny little promotion just to stop people using whack Donalds in anime. McDonald's sees it as free promotion. I mean, yeah, it's literally like still images in shows. And also, they also, uh, McDonald's knows PR to a degree. Like, they know, like, going uh, legal, getting into a legal battle after an artistic property in the realm of parody is like a death sentence for a company. Not really a death sentence, but, like, you're going to piss enough people off where it'll put a little bit of a dent into your product. Not a lot of bit of, of, of a dent, but McDonald's has way more things to worry about. Like, all fast food companies right now are way more worried about, like, the, the downward trend of people buying fast food. Because people are literally looking at their wallets and being like... Oh shit, I'm not buy- I'm gonna go buy rice and beans and chicken at the grocery store and just make that. I think the way larger issue for a lot of companies that we'll be seeing is, why aren't people buying our slop anymore? What the fuck? Oh shit, they're not buying our slop because our slop is too expensive? But that's how we make money, buddy. Everybody's slop is expensive. Curse you, local restaurants and grocery stores. I see that being way more of a worry for them than, like, funny little anime moment. Yeah, I'm buying a $6. I'm not paying fucking $15 for a McDonald's meal. I'm fucking sorry, bud. I don't want to pay fucking 3 bucks for a McChicken. I swear to God, dude. Swear to God, dude, I'm not paying fucking more than, like, a, a $2 for a McChicken. No fucking way, bozo. Ain't fucking likely. The hash brown is three eighty nine. dollars That's way more of an issue. McDonald's pricing is way more of an issue for them than, like, their funny little promotion. That's why they're trying to do, like, the funny little promotions, like the, what is it, Kerwin, uh, Kerwin White? Kerwin, now, Kerwin White's a wrestler, uh, like, a wrestler character, isn't it? Ker the, there was that one, like, funny little uh, chicken McNugget promotion they did. They're trying to, ooh, they're trying to incentivize people with, like, limited time objects. Bird. Enemy bird destroyed. Alright, Dad's waking up a little bit. Dad's waking up a little bit. Dad's not doing too hot, but Dad's waking up a little bit. Fast food chain's crying, throwing up and shitting when they can't change charge $20 for a frozen hamburger because the local stores have reasonable prices. I mean, yeah. Unfortunately, if you're in, like, a small town where fast food is pretty much unlikely your only option, um, you're not gonna find a lot of, like, local places or you're gonna find your local slop diner, but at the end of the day, like... I see an upward trend um, in in people uh, dropping fast food. Maybe not entirely, but trading it more like it is. Like, hey, fuck it. I'm going to cook Din Din instead. I'm just going to make fucking Din Din, dude. Why the fuck do I want to spend that much money on slop when I can just cook Din Din? I can just make a dinner. And I think that's, I think, I think, like, noticeably, I think we're seeing an upward trend. I mean, sure, like, there are always going to be people who spend way too much money on fast food without realizing it. Like, I had a coworker at Best Buy who would DoorDash everything. And I had to, I had to be like, dude, you know that you work five days a week. You are spending 20 to $30 every day you come into the work. Every day you come into the work. Every day you come into the store, you were spending 20 to $30 on lunch. That is uh, two hours of work, like two to three hours of work gone. Because you wanted like Big Mac burger. 
Nah, quality is tanking. Prices are going up. Uh, I think I think I think we're seeing an upward trend of people dropping fast food to a degree. People do that and then wonder why they're broke. Yeah, I mean, Shelby and I do meal prepping. We have a little treat every once in a while. We had Texas Roadhouse for our cheat day this month, which was really good. But also, like... Oh, this guy real. Gotcha. Ooh, this guy fucking hurt though. Oh, he running. Oh boy, he running. Sorry, I got a little. I got a little. Uh, don't mind me. Got a little medallion guy to kill. Damn, if I had hit that though, those were close. Those were close shots. I'm not gonna lie. I've known the people that do that, too. They're spending a ton of their income on it. Yeah, I mean, like, you, uh, looking at how much people spend on, uh, like, an incredible amount of... Uh, just an insane and zany amount of fast food is insane. And, like, not budgeting any money and just buying shit outright. Like, dude, you gotta take a little bit care of yourself. You gotta pay a little bit of attention, dude. I'm not gonna police somebody's fucking life. Like, do whatever the fuck you wanna do. But at the same time, like, dude... If your if your fast food budget is like hundred and fifty dollars a week, if you're buying fast food five days a fucking week, that's insane. Dude. Yeah, but it takes thirty minutes to cook food. That's long. Well, yeah, but you don't have to cook food every day. That's what meal prepping is literally for. Meal prepping is, is literally for that. It's you cook one day, and then you have food for the rest of the week. Hi, Bobby. Bobby on the lap. Oh, she was trying to be on the lap, and then she ran away. I do it seven days a week because I'm lazy and I need to fucking stop. Hey, you know, it's, it, do whatever you want to do. It's your fucking money, right? I'm not going to fucking sit here and be like, don't do that. That's stupid. Like, buy whatever you want to buy. If you enjoy it, you enjoy it. But, like, for me, it's a case of, yeah, no, I can't fucking do this. I was, I was like, I, uh, we were spending far too much money when we could just buy a big bag of chicken and eat a bunch of weird chicken grease. Spending way, far too much fucking money when you could just buy a big bag of chicken. Oh, this guy steal my car, bro. Really? Damn, I wish you could hit people in these fucking cars. I don't think it gives you, like, an advantage when it comes to it, but jeez, Louise, do I, do I fucking hate... Like, the fact you cannot hit people in cars anymore. Because of the, like, change... In the way this shit is, I just, I feel like you cannot fucking get car shots anymore. So, like, if you're in a car, you're just the car's health pool, unless... Oh my god, why the fuck did I drop my... Oof. I just hate, I just hate, I hate cars. Me looking at vehicles, uh, means of locomotion, I fucking hate them. Oh, is that his friend? Oh, that's his friend. Got him. Demon. Sorry about that. Sorry. I'm, I'm evil. I'm evil. I'm evil. I'm a little evil. I'm allowed to be a little evil as a treat. Honestly, just buy an air fryer, rice cooker, pot, and casserole pot, and you can make anything in 30 minutes. I mean, yeah, a lot. A big part of it is like a lack of motivation, and I understand that, because that's, I think, for me and Shelby, for Shelby and I, that was a big part of, like, switching over to meal prepping, because we were just fucking tired and sick and tired and buying fast food and it's way fucking easier and it's right fucking there and it's like well i'll spend the money well i'll spend the money and like i don't know i for me that mindset was really bad where i was just like oh dude i can't bobby hi 
Hi, she yelling. Hi. She's so fucking, she's so fucking yelly. She's so fucking screamy. Um, for me, I was like, I can't do that. I want to lose weight. I want to get a little healthier. Like, I had to get in that mindset of like, it's okay to be hungry. It's okay to be like fucking chilly and air about this. Oh god, they're really, they're really good at shoots. I'm dead. They were really good at shoots. Son of a bitch. Are your cats getting along now? No, Bubby is down. Bubby is down here. Beals is upstairs. We're swapping them. Uh, but I mean, yeah, when it, when it comes to like the food thing, I can get it. I, it comes from a lack of like motivation and not wanting to do it. And it's way easier to go and get fast food. But at the end of the day, like for me, this is why I switched over and why Shelby and I switched over to meal prepping. Because instead of like cooking every day or eating fast food every other day, it's food is done. Pop it in the microwave for two minutes. Uh, great. Food is done. And also at 30, I was like, damn, I really need to take care of my health a little bit. Mm, fire guy, sure. Brendan, have you considered that I don't have any arms or legs so I can't cook? That's bullshit. I see that one guy. He cooks with his mouth. He's on TikTok. He's fucking insane. I see that one guy on TikTok cook. You are a liar. You are silly. Hi, Rue. Happy birthday. Let's do that one. Get our ass kicked. No, I think cooking is important. I think I think they're. It, it, it's really easy to fall into that like pothole of wanting to only eat fast food because you get home from like an eight-hour shift and you're like, I don't want to do anything. I can stop at the McDonald's and get a sandwich. Or I can go home and try to cook for half an hour to 45 minutes. Like, fuck. Um, but I don't know. For me, like... I don't mind... Uh, eating the same thing for like five days in a row. I don't, I don't care. This doesn't like bother me in any way. So I don't worry about like the variety or whatever. And then also it has made like fast food and restaurants more exciting. Because when you do go and get fast food or when you do go and get something... Instead of it just being like, well, it's Slop Tuesday. I got to go and get Little Caesars again. Well, it's Wednesday. This is McDonald's Day. It's like, oh, it's been like a month since I've had Taco Bell. Holy shit. What is that going to be like? It's a good experience. It's a little treat. Yeah, it's, it puts you in the little treat mindset, which is way better. I am all meal prepping can be fun. Yeah. Well, I mean, for me, um, Shelby, Shelby, uh, still hates it because we both hate cooking, but 
I'm making, what is it? I'm making a protein pasta on Saturday. That'll be fun. I'm helping make a protein pasta. I'm not touching the shrimp, but I'm. Uh, we're making a protein pasta. Sounds yummy. It'll be okay. It'll be interesting. Protein pasta is weird. I don't hate it, but I don't love it either. Guess you use different seasonings to hang up the flavor. I mean, yeah, it's just gonna be Alfredo sauce. It's gonna be shrimp Alfredo, I think. Basically gonna be shrimp Alfredo, but with marinara. Not marinara, fucking uh, protein pasta. Brain dead. Where are you? Please don't kill me. Sorry, gamer. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> like, that was like a one-two combo there. What is protein pasta? It's pasta with more protein. How are you doing today, Brendan, with quitting cigarettes? Well, it's not cigarettes, it's vaping. I never I never had a cigarette in my goddamn life, but... What are we, five days in, no vape? Uh... Throat still hurt? Just a little bit. Um, cravings are kind of bad, depending on the day. Or time of day, depending on what I'm doing or where I am. Um, lungs are fine. It's mostly just a throat throat issue and um, like a craving issue. Well, you should. Oh, man. Brendan, you should smoke a lot of cigarettes. Just a whole bunch of them. Brendan, you should buy a carton of cigarettes and just smoke them on stream. You could call it like a smoking cigarette stream and it'll be awesome. Stop. No. Stop. 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 Your throat hurts from not vaping? Yeah, you can get a sore throat from uh, quitting cigarettes or, or, or vaping. Brenda trash is vape pen. I threw it all away. Yeah. I, I threw it all in the dumpster. You don't want to be like your hero, Big Tobacco Jonesy? No. I don't want a carton of band band of cigarettes a day. <laughs> No, we're on day five. It, 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 every day it gets a little easier. Um, it's it, it tough. Should have donated your vape. Yeah, I should have brought all my vape, all my vaping stuff to Goodwill. I should have brought my like five used to like old vape mods, my like ten batteries, my like five bottles of juice left over. I should have all brought them to the Goodwill. Here, a donation for you for the children. Are you going to try to break your slime addiction this year? Yeah. I'll try. My slime addiction, I'll try. For you. Oh, God. I'm so sorry. I can't stop. I can't, I can't stop. I can drop the vaping, I can drop the cigarettes, I can drop the cigars, but I can't drop the slime, dude. I can't drop it, I can't do it. It's too hot. I can't just drop the slime. How do I do it? <laughs> I'm in a tree. I gotta get out of the tree. How much money to lick the slime? I mean, it's gamer gunk cleaner, so, like, I'm not... I'm not dropping it, babe. Ah! I'd be really embarrassing if you died to me, but I knew that was gonna happen with the frenzy on tap. No, it's like gamer gunk slime. It's like cleaning gel. And I've already used it. It's already got dirt and gunk in it. One second. There we go. It's not fidget slime. It's, it's dust cleaning gel that I bought at Five Below. Yeah. 
Oh, thank you, Nate Silly, yeah. for the prime sub. Wow. Yeah. Gotta be green today. Gotta be green. Gotta be green. Gotta be green. Gotta be green today. Gotta be green. Gotta be green. Gotta be green today. Gotta be green. Gotta be form one cell. It's been a while. We do a little bit. We do a little sell. We do a little selling. Hi. Don't yell at me, ma'am. She's yelling at me. Hi. Hi. I don't know why she's yelling at me so much. Look at her. Look at her! yell why she be yelling like that she'd just be screaming bubby gumpy bubby gumpy bubby unfortunately gumpy i wish bubby wasn't gumpy but bubby gumpy bubby gumpy this is so sad that bubby is gumpy like this but bubby do be gumpy Bubby's so fucking gumpy. Bubby's so fucking gumpy. She really is. I wish she wasn't so gumpy, but she do be gumpy. Bubby's so gumpy. One of these days, we're gonna debump Gubby. Bubby no be gumpy. But today, on this day of days, Bubby be gumpy. Horrible fucking day for Bubby to be gumpy like this, but Bubby do be gumpy or Bubby do be gumpy. Bubby's so fucking gumpy. Bubby's so fucking gumpy. Bubby Gumpy Shrimpy Company. <laughs> That's going on the fridge. That's so fucking good. That's such awesome. That's going on the fridge. That's so fucking good. Bubby Gumpy Shrimpy Company. <laughs> bitch, G Lie, B Lie. Goodbye, bitch, rat can die. G Lie, B Lie. Goodbye, bitch, rat can die. You just made the fridge. You just made the fridge. Oh, look at you now. Fat as a cow, round with fridge wealth. Look at you now. You're on the fridge. Isn't that great? You're on fridge. Bubby Gumpy Shrimp Company. Yeah. <laughs> Bubby Gumpy yeah. Shrimp Company. Yeah. It's going to be locked in my fucking brain now. Hey, you made the fridge. Thank you, Glass Brain, for the tier one sub. Hamburger, cheeseburger, Big Mac Whopper. Hamburger, cheeseburger, Big Mac Whopper. Hamburger, cheeseburger, Big Mac Whopper. Lie in the morning. We, we, hamburger, we, we, cheeseburger, we, we, Big Mac Whopper. Lie in the morning. Hey, Brennan, pop it in to wish you a good stream and congrats on nearly a week. Five whole days. We just got to keep going. Um, The first two weeks are the hardest of quitting anything. Go out where the boys at? Where the boy? Hello, are you the boy? Where the boys at? Where the, where the boy? Hey, hey, yo, the boy. I was just asking where the boys at. I'm gonna go into the vault. Where the boys at? Don't mark me. You're gonna tell people where the fuck I am, camera. Where the boys at? Where they at? Where the where the where the enemies at? Where are they? Where they go? Where? You have heard of Cell Max? Yeah, I'm Cell Maxing out my fucking dick as I plow your mom viscously and viciously. I'm sorry, that was mean. I thought it was a gotcha. Cell Max is like the uh, character from uh, Dragon Ball Superhero, right? That's like the bio Broly of Cell. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I was, I was, I was sinister maxing. I'm awful posting. I'm sinister maxing. Ain't Cell Max like the Bio Broly Cell? You want to repeat that? No, I'd rather not. I'm Bio Maxing. I'm 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 Swag posting. 
It's like if Bile Broly was good. Yeah, I, I mean, I've seen the movie. Gohan look cool. I like Gohan. Gohan cool. Gohan da boy. It's a new version of Cell. I mean, it's not really a new version of Cell, right? Isn't it just like a clone of Cell? It's not really a new version of Cell. It's like a clone of Cell taken from Cell Cells. To sell up the Cell. Yeah, they got the new androids in there. Those are pretty cool. They got pretty cool androids. I got the, uh, they got the, the new Gohan beam and the new Piccolo form, which is also pretty sick. You got the big Piccolo. You got big orange Piccolo and you got funny Gohan. I think if Gohan killed a man in the middle of New York City, I'd be like, you know what, Gohan? Fair play, Gohan. He probably deserved it. Clone is a new version by definition. No, because a clone could be the exact a copy of the same thing. Cloning something doesn't mean cloning something doesn't mean it's a new version. Cloning something means that it is a it is a copy of the exact same one. But I guess like it's a different kind of cell, so I guess like honestly that might work. Got you, Sergeant Doritos. What about you, you foul fool? Got you. You weren't real. The other person might have been real. Uh, no judge. No judge. No judge. No judge. No judge. Tell it to the people, Piccolo. I want to say something to the people, Piccolo. I'm not a big fan of the government. I am not a big fan of the government. I hate that that's the one Helldivers post I keep seeing on, like, TikTok, where it's, like, the audio of, Let me say something to the people, Piccolo! Let me say it to the people! It's like, I'm not a big fan of the government! I am not a big fan of the government! But it's, like, bugs? Because, like, how do the bugs get an illegal radio tower in Helldivers, right? Anyway, I maxed out your mom's credit card and made her pay my cell phone bill. Get owned. Oh, that's too bad. My mom's cell, uh, credit cards are already maxed, so. Yeah, she's uh, she's going through a rough time right now, so. I don't know why you'd say something like that. Um, yeah, she's trying to find a new house. I don't, I don't, I don't know why you'd say such a thing. That's a horrible thing to say. Yeah, I don't know why you'd say <laughs> Sad posting on main? It's more likely than you think. My library card is max. True. Right now, I was re-listening to the podcast earlier. Did you ever figure out what Drear was? No. Honestly, you can't ask me about the podcast because I don't remember, like, anything that was said on there. Much like I don't remember anything I say on the streams. Listen, I'll say, like, I'll say, like, some, like, elaborate bit. And people will reference it, and I'm like, I don't know what that is. Brendan, you said that. I said that? I said that. I don't remember saying that. Listen, man, I'll just say words until those words all come together into a, a compulsive sentence and then build a paragraph, and then maybe even build a little novella out of my jokes. Right, so the horny Twitch st stream thing is to green screen Fortnite gameplay onto a girl's butt. When will you stream gameplay on your feet? Right now. No, I'm kidding. Uh, never. Hopefully. Never, hopefully. I'm, th I'm thunking about it. I'm thunkular about it. Who shot at me? Oh, they're up there. I see him. Can't grab onto the big T. Gotcha. Sorry. Whoopsies. Let me just grab that. Get that. Let me swap that out. Grab that. There we go. 
And just like that, Cell has crown. What if Broly Dragon Ball had an OnlyFans and it was called Broly Fans? That's pretty good. When, Bro when Broly transforms, his dick looks like a little third arm that's fucked up. It can flex in everything. It it's all muscle, babe. It's all fucked up. A cell is crowning. Are you ready for the cell live birth? Does that mean we can just make up bits and claim they're from a previous stream? Please don't do that. Saying please don't do that is an incentivization to do that. Um, regardless of whether, whether or not I say to do that or to not do that, you will do that thusly. Um, please just... I, I'm going to fall for it at some point. Please just be careful. <laughs> Hey, Brennan, remember when you said that, like, it was a f crazy fucking bit that you were the guy who was ass assassinated Franz Ferdinand? No? Yeah, remember when you kept saying you were like, you were like, for like three hours, Brendan, you kept saying you were the guy responsible for World War II? I didn't, I didn't kill an Archduke, I didn't, I, Brendan, remember when you said that? Remember when you said that? You were responsible, Brendan, remember? That was a crazy bit, dude, crazy bit. Keep on keeping on, Brendan. Oh God, what have I? Oh God, what have I? Oh God, what have I done? What have I done? What have I become? What have I done? What have I done? What have I done? I'm just gonna reference obscure bits you did to keep you on your toes. Remember the grandpa monster alarm, Brendan? Remember the following cheese alarm? The what? The cheese alarm, Brendan. Remember when you would turn on camera and you just start slapping fat, wet slaps of cheese all over your face? <laughs> I remember, Brendan. That was crazy, dude. Are you, are you hiding? Nice. You shouldn't do that, by the way. I love your medallions, but you definitely should not have Zeused. Uh, I'm just, oh shit. Now I'm gonna do the exact same bit. Or I'm gonna hide so I can drink a potion. Do I have the Zeus? Do they have the Zeus medallion or the fucking Ares medallion? Ooh, wee. All right, they cleared out the upper echelons. Now I'm fucking schmoovin'. I do love to schmoove. Brendan, remember when you unhinged your jaw, yelled, I'm the Jankler, and then you ate an anthill? I do remember that. My love potions. Please read this in a wizard voice. I hope that was wizardly enough for you. Oh, I love potions. Oh, don't talk to me before. Wizards should treat potions like moms treat coffee. Don't talk to me before I've had my 3 a.m. potion. <laughs> I don't know about you, but I love a good potion in the evening, a potion in the morning, a potion in the afternoon. <laughs> We should bring wizards back. They should. Uh, life should be a little bit more whimsical. Feel a, a little bit more whimsy. Bring wizards back now. Bring them fucking back, or I'll get you. Not enough potion for your potion, eh, sir? You trying to throw slappers at me? I should stand by you, huh? Throw a slap at me. Give me slap. Yes. Not enough potion for you, eh, sir? More potion. Oh. oh. <laughs> Me drinking the, um, you fucking unhinge your jaw potion so I can eat eggs. And I remember when you were a lizard on a hot rock? Yeah, I remember. It was a wonderful day. Beautiful day. Bought a big slab of granite. $15,000 slept on that son of a bitch. It was fucking epic. I can feel my skin, the sizzling. I was like a boy barbecue, a boy barbecue. Yeah, true. Is coffee not a potion? You know what? Coffee is a potion. I think we should state this and make this thusly. I think we should talk to the legislation. I think we need to talk to the people. I think coffee is a potion. Bad thing about having two medallions is you have a larger target on your back. That means I'm gonna fucking die, ain't it? They're gonna fucking pop me. I'm gonna get fucking popped from 300 yards away. It's gonna be fucking sick. 
Right, now, remember when you buried a copy of The Sopranos for the PS3 in your backyard to watch the deleted content from the game? Uh, no, actually, it was a copy of Road to Respect, The Sopranos Road to Respect, where I buried it in my backyard. And then we watched the deleted content from the game. But it was a copy of the, the, the Road to Respect, The Sopranos game on PS2. That was the whole thing I did. That was one of my favorite moments the last year. Where I just lost my mind because the game wasn't working and I said, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. I'm gonna bury it in my backyard. One of my favorite bits. Alright, this person's gonna pop me and they're gonna get the extra crowns. They're gonna get the funny medallions, and I know it, but... Oh shit, there's another person. Oh, is that person coming from behind? I'm dead. I'm alive, but I'm not gonna be for long. We're getting away from that. Throw a splash on me? Chug splash? Thank you. Alright, better than nothing. We moving. I was so mad that I missed seeing that live. Yeah, that was one of my favorite bits from last year. I'd like to do more bits like that. That's another reason I brought camera back, or like camera on like... I I brought camera back into the mix. Um, and another, another reason I wanted to quit vaping is I didn't want to vape on stream. I thought it'd be cringe. I did. I quit vaping not just for, like, my wife and for me and my health, but I also did it for you, the chat. So you could suffer at my horrible little goblin face. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Train. Train was going into hell. I didn't know. I didn't realize. And I think you made the very world's first actual haunted game from a creepypasta by burying the Sopranos Road to Respect for the PS2. Imagine me the person who uncovers that, too. Like, imagine years from now, right? Oh, damn it, I wasted it. Imagine years from now being the person to uncover, like, just a buried copy. Like, 30 years from now, somebody's, like, digging in that backyard and they uncover the crusty copy of Sopranos Road to Respect. But I didn't stop vaping so we wouldn't get secondhand smoke. No, I mean, I think it's a cringe habit. And I also hate how much sometimes during streams my brain is like, okay, okay, cutscene's coming up, Brendan. Cutscene's coming up. That means you can you can vape in a little bit. Okay, okay. Break's coming up, Brendan. That means you can vape in a little bit. Like, so much of my life was dedicated to the next, like, fucking hit of my little uh, funny smoke cigarette electronic. My little computer. I hated hitting the computer, realistically. I liked a little bit of dopamine it gave me, but I, I realized at a certain point, like, nah, th this is it. I'm done. So for me, my wife, for the stream, I, uh, I'm done. I threw it all away. I'm not spending money on it again. I'll save money. Uh, I think it's a nasty fucking awful habit. I think it's a brain crutch for me that I do not need. I wouldn't recommend anybody to start smoking. I wouldn't say that anybody should start smoking or do any kind of smoking. It's, uh, it's bad and awful and not cool. You look cringe doing it. I'm sorry. Oh my god, another one. Oh my god, another one. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 it's ow, ow, oh, better believe it's not so, it's ow. I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna take that one, and then I'm gonna take that one, and now I have all of them. Now <laughs> come and kill me, feast or famine, come and destroy me. I have all four medallions! Come! Face me! <laughs> you little Saiyans, come and try to kill me. 
First, I'm gonna fuck you up. Uh, then I'm gonna find your mom and I'm gonna riz her up. <laughs> God damn. Little scary, isn't it, to be fighting a god? Not just a hero, but a god. <laughs> I'm a little freak. <laughs> this is my perfect form. I don't need none of your bullshit. Uh, just hand over a couple of those Taco Bell nacho fries. Uh, That's literally just Zorak? Yeah, I know. <laughs> Come here, you dumb son of a bitch. I'm gonna slap you fucking silly. Uh, I'm gonna make mincemeat out of your asshole. Uh, you ever see a prolapse before? <laughs> you will. Uh, I can't do a Cell voice. I can do a Zorak voice. I can do Zorak, I can't do Cell. I don't remember what Cell, like, first form sounds like, dude, so. I don't know. Don't be mad at me. You're like, huh, Brendan, why do you sound like this guy instead of that guy? Wearing your fucking neckerchief. Bet you have a handkerchief and a, and a neckerchief. And I bet you fucking, I bet you fucking sit there with your ascot. Like, fucking, like, plumped and ready for a delicious roast beast. Oh, Brendan, do the bit that I want you to do, you silly bimbo. Oh. Brendan, I think you're cringe, but I watch your content because I want you to do the bit that I want you to do, Brendan. Please. And I'd be like, no. I'd rather not. No, thank you. I'd rather not. No, thank you. This person, like, knows where I am decidedly, right? Oh, shit. They in the house. Oh shit! Got him! Yay! Pizza! Yay! That's three Crown Royales! Three! How many do you have? Brendan, I got 479 crown victory royales. I have three! That's three! <laughs> it counts. Lobby full of bots? Not, I mean, I, I got into like two fights. Three! Three! That's good. We love getting a win. We love getting a fat and sweaty win. Cell is the winning skin? No, I won with Cell, so now I can't use Cell. You know the rules. Never, 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 never forget to bev. No, I, I won with Cell, so I can't play with Cell now. Just got into stream. You seem to be in a better mood today. Well, yeah, because I'm five days into no vaping and, like, I have a nicotine patch on. I, I, get, I get the yummy patches for two weeks, and then I get the less yummy patches for two weeks, and then I should be done. What if I feed the dog a pizza? Oh, big pizza. Um, oh, we can get Afro Afro Aphrodite. Aphrodite. We can maybe get Lady. Can I claim the whole page? I can claim the whole page. We can get Lady. Look, she'd be on, like, d d d the cell phone. Be like, the Lady. We can almost get the Purple Lady. So close to having the Purple Lady. This shit insane, dude. We're so close to getting the purple version of the lady. Whoa! Or pink. Pink or purple. We're almost close to him, though. Who, who we really need. The hero we deserve. Funny Poseidon. And also Medusa, a skin I will probably never use. Yeah, I don't think, I don't think I'm ever going to use the Medusa skin. I'm so sorry, snakeheads. I'm so sorry, those of you with snakes for hair. Zeus is a maybe, but also probably going to get archived. I might use his glider. His glider is neat. 
he got the lightning bolt. May use his glider. May is that his? Yeah, he is. May use his contrail. Probably won't. Heard it's got bad visibility. So, and then funny, funny lightning emote. You should friend yourself now. Um, and then this one probably an archive. I might use Artemis. I kind of like her. She's got a nice look. Like the fire Artemis and the normal Artemis look fine. I'm not a big fan of the galaxy thing. Hades is probably getting an archive. I'm sorry, Hades. Same with like the second form Hades. Probably getting an archive. But he got cool. He got a cool glider. He got a funny chariot. But he's probably going into the into the hole. What is it? Funny Korra? From Avatar? And then what were the quest rewards? Got like the fire fire Cerberus, and then the other ones aren't revealed yet, which fair. And then Bonyas rewards. Um White Me, White Zeus. Uh this is a nice skin. I like it. I think I like this Hades a little bit more. He got the perp on he. And then we don't know about the super styles yet, but I'm sure they're probably gonna be garbage. I wonder if there's gonna be a marble one. I think that'd be cool. Very, very Greek, very pillar core. I'm gonna be pissed if you hang onto the bottom of the Hades chariot and not ride it. You're gonna hang onto the bottom of the chariots, uh, the, the 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 chariot. You're not gonna ride it. You are you are going to hang on the bottom of the chariot. You are not going to be riding it. I'm so fucking sorry. Hate hate to be the bearer of bad news. Hate to be the ball bearing of bad news, but yeah, it, there's no fucking way that you ride the chariot normal style. Are they with the Simpsons in yet? No, we got Futurama, we got Family Guy, so all that remains is uh, Bob Burger and Simpin. Len. 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 What if Bob Burger? Hercules skin would be neat. True, they got the Disney, they got the Disney collab. So it would be wild to see like Disney movies like imagine a suite of Disney princess Fortnite skins and imagine how many Disney headed people would be like Fortnite. I would love I would love Disney princess skins only because Disney adults would then immediately live stream Fortnite and it would be you would get the most hilarious compilations of Okay chat, what do I do with this? This is a gun? Oh my god, I gotta sh <laughs> You're telling me I gotta kill other people? Of course I'm gonna play, but like, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, chat. Thank you so much. You mean I can't just be friends? Oh my god. I just wanted to make a couple of friends. What the freak? Oh my god. <laughs> Make it sound like Disney adults aren't armed to the teeth. Yeah, they are, but it's all Keyblades. <laughs> Let me tell you something. I'm a Disney adult. I have a uh, season pass to Disneyland. Now, this right here is a uh, 44 caliber pistol. It is a uh, Wild West revolver. It is a, it is a 44 Magnum. This can penetrate three, maybe four sheets of plywood. Now, what I did here was I spray painted Mickey Mouse with this son of a bitch. Pretty fucking cool. Now, uh, let me tell you something, motherfucker. You can come into my house and you can disrespect me. You can disrespect my wife. But my 18 foot tall Funko Pop of Iron Man from Marvel? Oh boy, oh boy, buddy. You best be getting out of here. I'll tell you something, buddy. You say one bad thing about Star Wars, I'm gonna hit you with A, the Peterbilt, or B, my loaded AR-15. Now you can choose which one you choose, but if you disrespect my 1,500 foot tall Funko Pop of Darth Vader, <laughs> just jonkling it, just jerking it, I'm gonna fucking ruin you. I modded my shotgun to do the goofy yell when I shoot it, so it goes. <laughs> sick of this, <laughs> sick of this bullshit. They kicked me out of the shooting range because I keep going. <laughs> every time I fire my gun. I gotta stop doing this shit. I gotta stop yahooing when I'm hooing. <laughs> you can yahoo, you can hooey, but you can't wee. That's another thing about uh, not vaping that I've really found to appreciate is my vocal range is coming back uh, better than what it was before. And I'm able to just like, I'm able to keep going for longer. I will say the brain fog is there, so like I'm not like, 
you know, 100% yet. I'm like, I think I'm at like 65%. Look at it be so smooth. He's so smooth up there. So smoothy. Would love to have a 20 foot jar to put the 18 foot Iron Man Funko Pop in. 20 foot jar. 20 foot jar. 20 foot jar. 20 foot jar. Oh. 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 <laughs> uh, when the big monster attacks the city and the townspeople, they don't freak out. They just start chanting 20 foot jar. 20 foot jar. 20 foot jar for the 50 foot man. 30 foot jar. 30 foot jar. 30 foot jar for the 20 foot man. 40 foot jar. 40 foot jar. 40 foot jar for the 30 foot man. 50 foot jar. 50 foot jar. 50 foot jar for the 40 foot man. 60 foot jar. 60 foot jar. 60 foot jar for the 50 foot man. <laughs> <laughs> 60 foot jar for the 50 foot man <laughs> oh good times we have fun here <laughs> 60 foot jar for the 50 foot man 60 foot jar for the 50 foot man 60 foot jar for the 50 foot Man, 60 foot jar for the 50 foot man. It's gonna be locked in my head for like two fucking weeks now. We don't have fun here. Yeah, okay, but after I said that, Rock Distributor, I know you fucking smirked like a DreamWorks character. I know for a fact, I know for a fucking fact that you're like sitting there giggling and pissing and shit, and then you're like, <laughs> I don't enjoy this. <laughs> You're fucking smirking like Barry B. Benson. Like, I'm gonna get a human woman to fuck me. I'm a bee. Is that the attitude to have? Do you want to have a ratitude? Do you want to have a batitude? 60 foot jar for the 50 foot man. 60 foot jar for the 50 foot man. 60 foot jar for the 50 foot man. I feel like that'd go really good with, like, a guitar riff behind it. Like, just starting off this, like, the, like the beginning of, like, a really fucking weird song you find on Spotify. Where it's just, 60 foot jar for the 50 foot man. 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 <laughs> Can't stand it. I want to slam it. That's just a Primus song. It is. We're making modern day Primus out here. So you're real. Whoa! I don't have any close range weapons. I, you do. You're gonna win. Thought so. I, I didn't have any close range weapons, so. Delightful Jape, unfollowed swine. Did you unfollow again? God damn it. You can't keep doing this. I enjoyed this joke, Brendan. I have to leave. <laughs> like... No, I'm still here? Oh, okay. Now you're thinking about doing it just because I said it, though. Primus sucks. Fuck you! That's it. Fuck you. I don't care if this gets muted. I'm Primusing you. Primus sucks? No. That's the stankiest bass rip. You can't fucking. My name is Mud. I miss rocks. Brennan doesn't get it. I don't get anything. I am for now, then, and forever the number one no getter. My name is Mud. 
<laughs> Hell yeah, dude. Hell yeah. You know the Primus fans chant Primus sucks at their concerts, right? I didn't know that. It's like a mom band, so I I just like some of the songs from Primus. I don't I don't think about this stuff. I'm not like a fan of bands. I don't know this knowledge. I know this knowledge now. I'll internalize it. It's like a mom band. My mom used to listen to that shit. Primus is mom music. I don't... It's like Mudvayne, right? That shit's mom... Like corn, Mudvayne. Uh, a little bit of System of the Down. That's mom music. But I'm also not like, I'm not somebody in tune with like, um, like bands and their inside jokes. Not like fucking, oh, Brendan, you should listen to the Raving Raptors. They have this bit where they throw cottage cheese at the audience and then it gets all wet and sticky, but everybody's like, go Raving Raptors. And the Raving Raptors be like, 50 foot man in the 60 foot jar, 50 foot man in the 60 foot jar, 60 foot jar for the 50 foot man. <laughs> it's like, dude, I love the Raving Raptors. That song fucking bangs! And then they just... They, they bring out a bunch of watermelons. They just turn the whole audience into a fruit salad. And it's like, oh, dude, awesome. I'm not going to know about the inner machinations of, of, of the mind of a band. I don't pay attention to band news. I don't follow any bands. I have a Spotify liked songs playlist. And I put it on Smart Shuffle. And that's how I find music. The last concert I went to was a fucking... Uh, big Time Rush concert, 2022. Because I, I, I got bought a ticket, and I was like, I guess I'll go. Hi, you're going to kill me. Oh, wow. Okay, I didn't think that I'd live through that. I killed somebody. Uh -huh. Oh god, why did it fall like that? Will they summon Zeus? I'm out of here, dude. Nope. I'm dead. Oh, 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 oh. Sorry, these are my panic noises. Yeah, big time rush. Let me hear it big time. Uh-uh. Uh-huh. Oh. Yeah. Mama sauce over lip. Mama eat sauce when you eat that sauce and you're gonna make it big time. Don't kill me. I know I got shot from somewhere else. That was not the person who fucking who tapped me. Definitely not the person who tapped me. I'm out of here. No, sir. I ain't getting out of this chair. No, sir. I am getting out of this chair. And I am fucking running. Pretty big time rush has this bit where Mr. Tumnus comes on the stage and pisses on everyone. It's so sick. No, they don't. I went to a, I went to a concert in 2022. They don't fucking do that. It's a bunch of millennial and Gen Z adults who are like trying to relive their childhood. They had a cool set. They had a really neat set. Um, I just... I. <laughs> That was the moment where I was like, dude, I'm a little bit old, because uh, I was at that concert, and it was like four hours, and I didn't like the music, uh, and I was just there to support my friends, um, and like, part of it was a little bit of like a Brendan suffering ritual, and I was there to support my friends, and I, I realized I was like, man, my feet hurt. <laughs> they do, you missed it. I never missed it. All I know about Big Time Rush is they got the, uh, 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 oh, and I got a shirt of them. Brendan is friends with Big Time Rush? I am certainly not. I am certainly not friends with Big Time Rush. I am certainly not. I guarantee you I am certainly not friends with them. I bought a shirt. That's the that's the most Big Time Rush commitment you're ever going to get out of me, is I have a Big Time Rush shirt. <laughs> that's their music. They'd be like... <laughs> Oh, so you guys have beef then? Yeah. I have close personal beef with the band Big Time Rush. 
They have done so many horrible things to me. You can clip this and send this to them personally. This is real, and I. this is not a lie. Anyway, that's not real, and that's not a lie. That is a lie. That is real, and it's it's a lie. We have big time beef with big time rush. Yeah, I was uh, I was in the bathroom, and the big time rush, the band, at their at the venue, they installed these things called big time flush. So you had to pay five dollars. Uh, to be able to go to the bathroom, and when you flushed, one of the big time rush uh, band members, their heads would pop out of the toilet, akin to Skibbity Toilet. I fucking hated it. It was a horrible experience, and I had to take like a massive dookie, and then I flush, and then a head fucking pops up, and it's like, oh! I have real beef with him for doing that. I hate big time flush. I hate that. They really had to do the big time flush bit to me, and I fucking despised it. Can you big time hush? Oh, no, sorry. Do you want me to buy you a big time plush? Oh, sorry. It, it, my bad for uh, uh, coming up with the big time gush. Oh, I, are my words to your ears just big time mush? Oh, are you going to take my head and big time crush? Oh, am I drinking? Is, you, is your dad drinking? Is he a big time lush? Oh, how are your teeth if you big time rushed? I'm going to big time kill you. There we go. Ah, uh, apropos. A little succulent brain meal for me. Everything you talk about Mr. Tumnus, I think you're talking about Tumgus. Ah, uh, Mr. Tumnus. Mr. Tumnus. I forgot that Mr. Tumnus was James McAvoy, and then I found a bunch of Mr. Tumnus thirst traps recently. <laughs> And I'm just kind of saving them up. I've, I've been collect. I'm, I'm like, I'm gonna collect Mr. Tumnus third st third straps because I totally forgot he was fucking James McAvoy. I totally forgot that James McAvoy in Narnia is, is Mr. Tumnus. Show him on stream. No, they use licensed audio. I'm not doing that. Sleepy Pete. Let me hire you. Oh. Sorry, I have to kill you. I have to put you out of your misery. I'm sorry, Meowsles. Oh, what the fuck? Did Meowsles kill me? Meowsles killed me. What? That was insane. That was an insane shot by the NPC. Okay, I have I have this one, and I'll mute it. But like, I have this one. It's not as thirsty. I think we need I think we need the Mister Tumnus thirst traps to be more thirsty. It's not as thirsty as I would like. It's not as thirsty as I would I would I would like personally. It could be thirstier. It could be a little thirstier, a little worstier. Mr. Tumnus, uh, tummy and nuss. <laughs> 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 Fuck. Mr. Tumnus, <laughs> tummy and nuss. Make him the cutest on the battle bus. <laughs> Sixty foot jar for the fifty foot man. Sixty foot jar for the fifty foot man. Sixty foot jar for the fifty foot man. <laughs> BTR big time return to Narnia. Wouldn't it be fucked up if you were watching a cop? Imagine if you were a kid and you were watching like the Backstreet Boys and you were like, yeah. And then you, like, go back as an adult, right? You go back as an adult and you pull out your old VHS tape. You blow the dust off of it like a... Like, man, this old Backstreet Boy concert. I really liked this as a kid. You know what? I should pull out the VCR and I should watch it. You grab the VCR out of the closet. You dust that off, too. You, you got a big VCR. You're like... 
You plug it in, you set it up, you put it into the old TV, you pop in the VHS tape of the <laughs> of the Backstreet Boy concert. You're watching it. But like Mr. Tumness is just there from Narnia. He's just walking around on the stage. Nobody is paying any attention to him. And at the very end of the tape, he looks, he cracks around, he looks at you, and then he puts his hands up and he starts walking towards the camera. You fucking turn the tape off, you bury it in your backyard. BTR Big Tumness Rush. Genuine fear. I got a game from the Goodwill. It was called the Evil Video Game. I brought it home and I put it into my GameCube. And Mario was there and we were jumping around and it was like Mario Sunshine. But then suddenly Mr. Tumnus was there with hyper-realistic eyes and he tried to grab me from out the TV. <laughs> Please, no Tumnus posting. I can't stand looking at James McAvoy as that sadier. Please, no James McAvoy, Mr. Tumnus posting. It is ruining the family discord. Or do you think if Fortnite had been around, they would have put Tom Hanks and Forrest Gump in the game? Yeah. You know, Jenny, life is like a box of chuck chuck. <laughs> you know, my mama always told me that life was life. <laughs> You know, my mom always told me, life was a lot like dropping off the battle bus. You gotta pick your location, and your spawn, and your weapons. <laughs> my mom always told me that life was like a box of Tumnus. You never know what kind of James McAvoy Mr. Tumnus thirst trap you're gonna pull out of there. But you know that it's gonna be vile. Listen, if they put the Polar Express conductor in this son of a bitch, I would literally, I would, I would literally explode. It would be like the grunt birthday party skull where my head would explode and confetti would leak. And it, 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 you just hear a, yay! Oh God, oh God, oh God, I fucked up. I fucked up. I have no gun. I have no weapon. I have a weapon. What have I become? My Swiss is free. F Everyone I know. Freefs and sweeps with the freaks. So an NPC hired the bot? Is that what happened? I can't hire him now. This is so sad. Do you have any thoughts on Woody Wood Woodpecker? I think it'd be really fucked up if Woody Woodpecker, like, got his beak stuck in one of the trees he was pecking, and he was going, <laughs> What is it? One second. <laughs> if he did that, and then he stuck his beak in a tree, and then, like, his beak got stuck in there, so when he pulled it out, he had a smooth human mouth. That'd be- that would fuck me up. I've thought about that before. What if Woody- what if, what if Woody Woodpecker was pecking the tree? And he just, he did his a trademark laugh, and then he hit the tree, and then he pulled away, and it was just a human mouth there. The beak was just extraneous, it was extra. It was just gone. Woody Woodpecker with a human mouth is far more terrifying than it has any right to be, and it could happen to anybody. You could be experiencing Woody Woodpecker with a human mouth right now and not even know it. Oh my god, the recoil on this son of a bitch be like the recoil on my ass. It's all over the fucking place. There we go. Ready, have you seen the live action Woody the Woodpecker movie? No, but I saw the Sonic movie and it's like the same thing, so. Doesn't the Sonic movie, like, look almost beat for beat like the Woody Woodpecker movie? But, like, it's Sonic and the, the character work is way more interesting, so, like, who gives a shit about Woody Woodpecker? Woody Woodpecker can't even go fast. I mean, he can, depending on the situation, but he's more of a gag character. Because when I see him, he makes me gag. They're making another new live-action Woody the Woodpecker movie. Um, even though the last one was in 2018. Why? Are they just trying to figure out what to do? They have the license, so they're like, let's do something with it. Does Woody the Woodpecker make your pecker Woody? Oh, oh, would a Woody the Woodpecker peck a Woody with wood, would you? Doesn't make any sense. Those aren't words. You're not speaking language. You're just making up shit as you go. 
What do you? Would you? Would you? Brendan? Would when? Would he? Woodpecker? When he? Would? Would he? Would he? How much wood could a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? Oh, what a woodchuck chuck wood? What a woodchuck chuck wood? Huh? 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 Huh? How much wood would a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? Huh? You were muted that entire time. No, I'm not, because I only hit the mute button when I was uh, when I was uh, still vaping, and I've quit. I'm five days clean. No vape. Do the Woody Woodpecker laugh streamer? I already did. That's it. That's it. I can't do it perfectly because I haven't practiced it in forever, but like, I can do it. How much wood would wood cut chuck? How much wood would wood chuck chuck if a wood chuck could chuck wood? That's what a real wood chuck would sound like. You bastard, that's why you muted? I never muted. Well, I used to mute all the time. That was, that was such a strong five-day streak. Let's go for seven. We're not going to go for seven. We're going to go for forever. We are on five days right now. We're going for forever. No vaping, babe. We have put it all away. It is all in the box, and I threw it all away in the garbage. We are free. We are clean. Um, I have nicotine patches that it will help me get through like the worst of the crank, and then... Uh, my lungs and voice are gonna heal, and it's gonna be awesome. How much Bren can a Bren Dan Dan if a Bren Dan can Bren Daniel? I'll tell you how much Bren a Bren Dan can if a Bren Dan can Bren Daniel. A Bren Dan can Bren Dan a lot of Bren if a Bren can Dan a lot of Bren. A Bren can Dan a lot of Bren, and a Bren can a lot of, do a, a Dan a lot of Daniel. But a Bren Daniel can Dan a lot of Yol if a Bren can Bren Daniel. That's close enough. He's gonna swap to Zin. No fucking way. I'm not putting shit in my mouth. How much bread can a bread bread Dan if a bread Dan bread can bread Daniel? I'll tell you how much bread a bread Dan can if a bread Dan can bread Daniel. That's what I'm saying. Five day streak. Use your cruise missile. Oh sweet. No vaping, so I get a cruise missile. This is so awesome. I'm gonna hit the local Arby's. Hopefully they evacuate in time. Swear to God, if they don't fucking do it this year, I swear to God, if Arby's doesn't do a fucking roast beast sandwich for the fucking Grinch movie. Just in general, like, there doesn't even need to be a new Grinch movie. I swear to God, they are sitting on a gold mine. They are sitting on a gold mine. Right there. Roast beast sandwich with a fucking slice of pineapple in that son of a bitch. I'm fucking putting my goddamn foot down. I'm putting my fat, wet stompers on the ground. I'm gripping the fucking floor with each individual toe. They should have had a roast beast sandwich. Every day of my fucking life. I know IHOP had a Grinch menu. I don't know if it had a roast beast sandwich on it. IHOP does some Sue stuff, but Arby's should have done it. Arby's should have done it. They could have done it. They should have done it. They would have done it. They're literally the roast beef, right? And ooh, what I would kill for a hot ham and cheese right now. Ooh, I would kill a man. Who would like to be the sacrifice? I'm going to destroy you for a hot ham and cheese. Who wants to die so dad can get a hot ham and cheese? Which one of you wants to give yourself to me? <laughs> Which one of you wants to give yourself to the gods so I can have a hot ham and cheese? Make your choice. You have five minutes. Oh, see, already people are people are already giving themselves up. That's fair. No, I can't have a hot ham and cheese, even though I really want a hot ham and cheese. Brennan, would you love Shelby if she was a Grinch? That's a hard question. Um, that's a tough question. Um, on one hand, the Grinch. On another hand, Gussy? I don't know. That's, that's a tough one. I would still love my wife, yeah. If my wife was the Grinch, I would still love my wife. Yeah, 100%. That's not gonna stop by. That's gonna, that's not gonna stop me. I... Do you like driving the car? Do you like driving the car? Do you like the side of your own blood? Do you like driving the car? Do you like the side of your own blood? Do you like driving the car? Do you like the side of your own blood? Would you love her more? I'm not gonna love her more. I'm gonna love her the same. Um, but it would be it would be tough. I mean, whenever you ask somebody the would you love your significant other if they changed into a different creature? Um is, is a hard question, because when it, when it gets right down to it, I will love my wife regardless, but I'm not going to say that it's not going to be hard, right? Especially during Christmas time, uh, if my wife was the Grinch, right? Because then she's going to be, like, trying to Grinch everything up. Um, 
whenever you ask, would you love your wife if they were a worm? Would you love them if they were a worm? I mean, of course, true. But, like, can you keep loving them forever? Will you be able to find the wizard to turn them back into your significant other? Because, like, face value, like, looks aren't everything. Um, love is love, and love is work. And, and that surely would be a definite, like, trial for me. Um, but I love my wife, so if my wife is still the same wife on the inside, I mean, obviously, I'm gonna love my wife. Is Bubby screaming again? Bubby screaming again, yeah. Bubby, I would love you if you were the Grinch. Bubby, I love you now! I love you, Bubby. Okay, Brendan, but what if you join Shelby in stealing Christmas? I'm not gonna get arrested. If my wife wants to have some extracurricular activities where she breaks into people's homes and steals their Christmas presents, that's that's on her. That's her prerogative. I'm not getting arrested. Whoville, Whoville didn't have a dedicated police system. The real world does. Bubby Beal's getting along yet? No, Bubby's just down here. We're separating them for a little while until dinner. But it's almost time for Bubby to go upstairs anyway, so... Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Good shot. Good, jolly good show. They fucking swap and shoot. I'm not that good. I can't fucking do that on the fly. Ooh, hey. All right. We are going to take a little break, though. We are going to do a cat swappy. So give me like five minutes, five to eight minutes. It may take me a little bit. Um, Maybe fast may take me a little bit. Depends on how wrangling them goes. And I'm going to get a drink, so. Give me a little bit, and I'll be right back. Enjoy the void.
All right, I'm back. Um, good swap, good swap. Bubby didn't throw up, not even once. Uh, I think there was a, a good swap. Gotta keep doing it, so. The more we swap them, the more they get used to it. But I think it was a good swap. No throw up from Bubby. Um, no nasties from Beals. And they didn't see each other, so. Bobby didn't throw up, you did. Chad, I gotta be 100% with you. I threw up. Not true, I didn't throw up, what am I, a fucking baby? Me? I'm baby? No! You're baby. You! No! Your baby? No. Your baby. Okay, now you're just trying too hard. And I know trying too hard. Uh, I guess we do swimming, sure. I got fucking cold ass hands again today. Ooey. Oh, maybe I gotta bring up the space heater again. It's chilly outside. It's raining meat and and beans and and soup. It's chilly. It's okay, Brendan. We all throw up and then slip on our own throw up sometimes. I don't. I've never done that before. It's March. Yeah, but it's cold out. It's like 30, 30, 40. I have really bad circulation. All right. Jeez, Louise. I got cold hands. I get cold hammies. Hands and feet and hands and feet. They both cold, dude. You gotta chill. You gotta chill. You gotta chill. All right, long veins. <laughs> Why does that sound like a vampire slur? Okay, long veins. Whoa, buddy. Hey, whoa. We don't say that. What year were you born? Uh, 1850. Oh, shit. All right. Well, that makes sense. <laughs> Hello, smooth skin. What did you say? What the fuck? Dude? Dude? What the fuck? Bro, you can't just say long veins, dude. You can't just... What the fuck? Dude, no. No. Oh, we got a brown tea. Oh, neon salmon. Salmonella. I can rhyme orange with banana. Or nana. Oh. I think it'd be way cooler. Vampires would be way cooler and infinitely cooler if they could, like, raise and open up their jaw and then fire their teeth out like a gun. I think that'd be way cooler. Like, imagine if a vampire just had, like, a bone machine gun in their mouth. They just firing it crazy style. Alright, what are we, what are we, what are we, what are we joshing? What are we joshing? Where that, where that jumbo sauce at? Where that jumbo josh at? Vampires would be cool if they could live in the sun without dying? No, but that's, like, the point of being a vampire. Like, that's the nerf. That's like the nerf that you get as a vampire, is you can't live in the sun. You gain immortality and the ability to only drink blood as your food, and like, you can't see the sun. It's like, it's like being a gamer. You, you can't go outside, the sun will fry you. Where's that sweet, savory, whack Donald sauce, Brendan? I don't have... I haven't had McDonald's in like a month, dude. I, I'm on a diet, and uh, like, I cannot. McDonald's will kill me. It will destroy me. I'll put it into my body, and I'll fucking immediately explode. I'll implode. They already have garlic as a nerf. Garlic's such a shitty nerf, though. They need an overall, overall nerf, a.k.a. the sun. They don't need to fucking grocery shop anyway. Like, come on. What are they doing out there in the sun? Oh, vampire wants to go to the beach, Brendan. Yeah, okay, fuck off. They don't need to go to, they go to the beach at night. Imagine going to the beach, going to the beach at night. 
What if they want to catch some rays, Brendan? Yeah, but what if they went to the beach at night? Hmm? Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Going to the beach at night. Hunt you down in a mercy. Hunt you down on nightmare long. Eat your sandwich right here. Eat me big meal every year. Yeah. You're not real. We got TMNT skin bots now, huh? Interesting. Yabba da ba do ba. Hunt you down all Flintstone long. Feel me yabba my do. Feel me do every yabba dab, yeah. Yeah, you lost your beach privileges for the, the for the myriad amount of powers you get. Vampires don't go to the beach. Like, during the day. It's just, it's just, uh, they, like, they don't need it. You don't need it. You don't need it. You can literally turn into a bat and fly. Like, you can grow up about, like, the sun. You can get over it. There are a lot of people who work night jobs who never fucking see the sun. Like, why is it so different that you're a vampire? Right? Somebody works a night job, they, they don't ever fucking see the sun. Right? They fucking wake up, they barely see the sun as they get to work, and then they get to work, and it's like fucking, oh, yep, this is my, uh, 9 p.m. to 3 a.m., 9 p.m. to 5 a.m. shift, and I'm getting home just as the sun rises to go to bed, uh, for work the next day. It's like, uh, night, people with night jobs don't get special powers. They don't get, like, magic powers because they work a night job. Why should a vampire get special powers and, like, uh, uh, have resistance to the sun? What about having to compulsively count things? I mean, having to compulsively count things is just inherently a funny vampire debuff. I'm driving away. Yeah, that's right. Fucking thought so. Knew if I knew if I took your kill away. Um Reload, thanks. You're not real. It's okay. Yeah, I mean like when it comes right down to it, I don't know, when it comes right down to it, I'd like I I just I have no interest in being a vampire. That just sounds lame. Come on. Oop, you fall down. Oop, you need help. Ah, son of a bitch. Ah, son of a- son of a bitch. Ah, son of a bitch. Brennan jokes on you. As a night shift person, I have special powers. No, you don't. Your special powers are lack of vitamin D and, uh, depression. I- <laughs> That's the night shift special move. Go! Have to take a vitamin D vitamin so I can get sun. Just drink milk? I mean, the sun's not in the milk, is it? Is there sun in the milk? They put vitamin D in the milk, you know, but yeah, but then you're drinking milk. There's vitamin D in milk? Yeah, but you just take a funny vitamin instead of drinking all that milk. You don't need that much milk. There's a little sun in the milk? Yeah, but like, you don't need that much milk. You need a little bit of milk, but like, you don't need that much milk. Motherfuckers, motherfuckers, grow up. Be told every day you need to drink eight glasses of milk. And it's like, you fell for it, dude. You fell for the milk lobby. You do not need that much milk. You fell for it, dude. Milk lobby is out there. The whole Got Milk campaign was literally insane because they had too much milk. So they're like, how do we get rid of milk? Let's tell everybody they need to be drinking a lot of milk. I'd fill a big thermos full of milk and pretend it's coffee. Ugh. Hey, you got this old thermos lying around. Ooh, geez, how long this been in here? It's just water, right? No, wait, no. That's three-year-old fermented milk. A 
big milk wants you to drink a lot more milk. Me personally, I think you should drink a lot more slime. I'm not going to lie. A lot of people out there not going uh, going out into the local woods, finding the nearest rock and just licking it clean of all its slime. Think about all the vitamins you can get from slime, huh? Motherfuckers be like, cheese, 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 milk, 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 milk. And it's like, uh, dude, what about slime? What about finding a rock, a nice cool rock covered in slime and moss? Whatever happened to that? Whatever happened to the good old days where you go outside and just find a cool rock covered in slime and moss? You just lick all the slime and moss off of there. Whatever happened to the good old days? Whatever became of this country? Back in the good old days, people used to just go out and find their own rock. Right? Everybody be out there finding their own boulder, their own rock, and they just licking the slime right off of it. Nowadays, everybody gotta all be about the goddamn, ooh, cheese, ooh, I need a little bit of, ooh, I need a cheese, ooh, I need a charcuterie, ooh, I need a little cheese, ooh, I need a little, ooh, I need a little snack, ooh. Ooh, I need a big Lunchable. Ooh, I need a big pizza. Ah, son of a bitch. Fuck of a man. But nobody these days want to just slurp up that lichen, that algae. Um, it's just, it's just ruined. No slime. Not enough, not enough slime out there. Whatever happened to slime love? Whatever happened to slime life? Why are the, why, 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 why are we the way we are? A chicken. Oh boy, if you eat a big pizza. Where does eyes go? Why, when they when the use a chicken emote, why do his eyes disappear? Like, why do, why do his eyes just, he because, this is horror. This is a hell skin. This is a nightmare skin. Oh, oh, I need a big pizza. Oh, 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 I need a big pizza. Oh, oh. Hi, Beals. Big pizza exorcism. Big pizza exorcism. With the 50-foot man in the 60-foot jar. Got a 60-foot jar for the 50-foot man. Such a fucking awful chick. He's such a fucking awful skin. Crab chicken. Why is he just so haunted? He has no fucking pupils. When he emotes, he has his pupils disappear. Why is he haunted like this? <laughs> Why does he look like this? <laughs> Why? Why did they build him like this? Why'd they build him wrong? Why did God build him wrong on purpose as a joke? Why did they build him wrong like this? What are they doing out there in the Fortnite factory building him wrong on purpose like this? How much you wanna bet Epic never fixes that? How much you wanna bet in three years time when they never re-release this skin ever again? People are gonna be saying that this is the one of the rarest skins you can ever get. How much you want to fucking bet? How much do you want to bet in three years? There's going to be TikToks that'll say, Rarest skin never reappeared in the item shop ever again. And it will never appear again. And if it does appear, it won't have the back bling and it won't have the, the pickaxe. And it'll be in there for half of a day. Chicken. <laughs> Chicken. You could literally, they were literally hiding behind a pole. They were so skinny. And I come in just to... <laughs> it's so fucking... So incredibly... Core... Pizza. They should add Eustace and Muriel from Courage the Cowardly Dog to this game so that I could be Eustace and I could have a I'm getting me mallet emote. 
It's like that elephant standing behind a pole thinking it's hidden. It's the same fucking thing. Now, I think hitboxes are the same, but, like, you're going to be spotted from a mile away. I don't think the hitbox on this skin is larger. Um, Fortnite scientists are morons. Uh, but definitely, 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 the the size is is definitely a, a, a net negative all across the board. I posted a video of you in stream chat, Brendan. I swear to fucking God. God damn it. Why do I got to look at this shit? Uh, let me pull it up. Talk about penis video? <laughs> Fuck off. I I'm not playing that shit on stream. I played I played the audio. You wanna talk about penis video? <laughs> Fuck off. You wanna talk about penis video? Hamburger cheeseburger big mac whopper hamburger cheeseburger big mac whopper hamburger cheeseburger big mac whopper her lie in the morning hey 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 hamburger hey 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 cheeseburger hey hey big mac whopper her lie in the morning oh let me get that oh let me get oh let me get that pub shotgun oh 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 yeah do you want to talk about? Do you want to talk about penis video? I don't know. I'm not. I'm trying to not think about penis video. But the more I feel like penis video is a memetic hazard, the more I think about not thinking about it, the more I think about penis video. You want to talk about penis video? I missed. That was such a fucking bad shot. Bye bye, Kratos. Chicken. Who the fuck? Nobody uses that skin. Don't lie. Epic. Don't lie. Don't lie. Epic. Don't lie like that. Nobody uses that skin. Don't lie. What the hell is penis video? I know, I don't know, but you're thinking about penis video, aren't you? There, not there, 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 there may or may not be a penis video, but you're you're thinking about penis video, right? Like you're thinking about penis video, right? Every day with this shit, this fucking dude, he's thinking about penis video again. Oh, this is the sniper. Sorry, can you chill? Oh, I need a big pizza. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Good fucking emote. Glad it's back. Get the peanuts brainworm out of there. All right. Now you're definitely going to let me kick the football, right? Yeah, I'm going to let you kick the fucking football, dude. Of course, I'm going to fucking... <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm going to fucking let you kick the... Bro, I'm going to let you kick that fucking football, dude. You're going to fucking... Oh, yeah, I'm not going to fucking pull it away, I promise. <laughs> you're a fucking idiot. You're a fucking fool. I'm going to pull it away at the last second and you'll have nary an idea, you fucking moron. You idiot. You buffoon. And then he goes and he kicks the football and then he implodes. Oh... Why did you taunt that when you fucked it up so badly? I think it's funny. <laughs> Much like, uh, what is it? Uh, fucking Mad World by Gary Jules. A funny kind of funny. A funny kind of sad. The dreams in which I'm dying are the best I've ever had. Family Guy cutaway where Peter Griffin goes to the grocery store. Every time I keep thinking about that. That's just like my favorite. My favorite idea of a Family Guy cutaway bag, uh, gag is just. Lois, remember the time I went to the grocery store? Ah, two ninety nine for bread. Nice. Just want a whole episode of Family Guy where all of the cutaway gags are morbidly, morbidly mundane. Always remember that time I went to get my teeth cleaned at the dentist. Huh? Ah, thanks for cleaning my teeth. Ah, no problem, Peter. I think about it all the time. Just incredibly mundane Family Guy cutaway gags. Man, this is worse than the time I, I walked down to the gas station. Ah. Cool. Rain energy drink. $3.99. That's pretty expensive. Well, pretty pricey. Chicken. I want a good assault rifle. I want slime. Oh. 
This is worse than the time I was at the Spencer's Gifts. Would it be fucked up if you went to a Spencer's Gifts and the guy who plays like the real life Peter Griffin was there? Would that fuck you up? I think that would fuck me up. I think there are a couple things in this world that would fuck me up beyond belief, and I think that's something that would fuck me up. Eh, so what are you buying? <laughs> Check out that section over there, man. Fucking dildos, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Thank you, real life Peter Griffin. Yeah, no, I know. I'm uh I'm just in here shopping for some novelty items, I know. Yep, I uh I uh hey Peter, hey, Peter, hey, Peter, hey, Peter. Yeah, I'm just here uh shopping for some normal items, just some accoutrements. Uh just gonna buy this weed bong rip t shirt and uh, I'm gonna get out of here. Hey, check it out. Eldos. Yeah. Would real life Peter Griffin be buying a bong? Real life Peter Griffin buying a Brian Griffin bong at the Spencer's Gifts. Incredible moment in, in real history that needs to happen. This is something where I just need to see a five to eight second TikTok of just the real life Peter Griffin guy buying a bong. It doesn't even have to be a specific bong. It could be any bong. God, you're gonna you're gonna get me. I'm the chicken. I'm the chicken. I'm I'm the foul fool. Oh, you mean you want to purchase a water pipe? It's not a bong. It's not a bong. It's not a bong. It's a water pipe. It's not a bong. True, true, true. It's not a bong. It's not a bong. It's a water pipe. It's not a bong. It's not a bong. It's a water pipe. Don't call it a bong. Don't call it a bong. Don't call it. Don't call it a bong. Don't do it. Don't call it a bong. It's a water pipe. Don't do it. Don't call it a bong. Don't do it. John Wick. Now, don't call it a bong. It's a water pipe. John Wick, eat a pizza? Oh. John Wick, eat a pizza. What if John Wick, eat a pizza? John Wick Chapter 5 leaked. <laughs> he starts it off. He's just eating a pizza. People keep asking me if I want a slice. Yeah, I think I want a slice. You know, everybody keeps asking me, where are you, John Wick? And I keep telling them, I'm at the Little Caesars. I'm getting a fucking slice! Judge Wheel? Judge Wheel? Really? Judge Wheel? Judge Wheel out here. Judge Wheel? Interesting. Hmm. Judge Wheel. You say John Wick goes to the fucking Little Caesars, he gets a crazy combo, and he puts down one of the Continental Coins. And he's like, here, take this. They're like, hmm, Mr. Wick, huh? Don't mind if I do. And <laughs> they give him extra crazy sauce. They give him real extra marinara for his breadsticks. Don't worry, sir. The gun is in the pizza. And he opens up the pizza, and it's just like a- it's like a gun with a pizza haphazardly put over it. Oh, I'm Keanu. I'm Keanuing out. Whoa. Oh. I know Krun Fu. Yeah. Oh, this already broke. I forgot. I forgot they broke this. Damn. Why'd I go in here? Why'd I fall for it? The gods took out the society. The gods took out the underground. 
Curse you, God, and all your minions. Fuck you, making this place completely worthless to drop at. Oh. Maybe getting up. Hole completely closed. Hole sealed. The Ninja Turtles have left and every hole is now sealed. Oh my god, this is Fortnite. Uh, there are always a motherfucker or two at Pleasant Piazza. Yeah, I hear him. Oh shit! Jonesy! Sorry, Jonesy. I had to John Wick you. Oh shit, ow. Ooh, fear. What kind of a fight is happening up here? Hi. Bye. Thank you. Get charmed, get wicked. In the new hit movie, Jam Wick. Yeah, do you like the sight of your own blood? I don't know why, but in my head, I just really love to see Keanu Reeves play Skyrim. And somebody tells him it's just the- that's- <laughs> What if you put- What if you fucking- What if you abducted Keanu, Keanu Reeves and you just put like a VR headset on him, you glued it to his head, and it was just playing Skyrim? It's like, whoa. This is my reality. Now, honestly, fucked up thing to do. Like, not gonna lie, that's a fucked up thing to do to another human being. But like, how fucking funny. <laughs> do you think he'd, he would know, right? He'd know it's VR. But what if he didn't? What if he was just like, This is it. I'm finally here. White run. This is awesome. <laughs> John Wick, yeah, Keanu Reeves being released from like the uh the the the, the Skyrim VR uh like prison. Whoa, what the fuck? This isn't White Run at all. Hey, you, you never should have come here. Then he just starts fighting people in the hospital. Hey, you, you never should have come here. Hey, buddy, Buster, pal, you uh, you never should have come here. Can I hit that John Wick from here? One more. Damn it, son of a bitch. Damn it, shit. I'm not- I'm not used to the fucking- that's a far-ass shot. We tried, though. Oh my god, did I try. I tried all the time. In this institution. And he prayed. You never should have come here. Alright, am I the weaker John Wick? I would assume I'm the weaker of the Wick. Where did that John Wick go? Oh god. He's gone. He Johned, then he Wicked. Oh my god. Is he setting a devious trick for me? Oh, my motorcycle. My motorcycle company. Whoa. I could challenge the dog man, the man who dogs. I can challenge the dog man, the man who dogs. I don't know if I'll win, I don't know if I'll get sniped by another player doing it, but I can try. Reloading, reloading. Alright, you're gonna summon the man who dogs, the man who dogs the man. Nope, more dogs. More dogs! Firing bullets at me. Stop that. I'm trying to fight the dog. And the man who dog. There we go. Here comes the man who dog.
Let me reload. Sorry, sir. Can I reload? Let me slash you? No, thank you, sir. I'd like to reload. Thank you. And I'd like your funny token. That'd be great. Thank you, sir. Doesn't even matter if I fight the man who dogs, because, like, the, the fucking... The, the auto frenzy I have is technically better than his gun, so... There can only be one! Yeah, true. I might have to fight that John Wick at some point. Or he'll snipe me out of nowhere, which, honestly, if he does, he deserves the win. He will deserve the W. Brendan, happy St. Patrick's Day. I love you. You mean a lot to me. Happy St. Patrick's Day. I hope you have a big... Um, I hope you have a green meal. I hope you have a green steak, a green bean, maybe a green potato. I have a lot of green meal. I hope you have a green meal. I really do. I hope you have a really green meal. I hope you have some green eggs, maybe some green ham. Have a good green meal for St. Patty's Day. You deserve it. Oh, broccoli and green beans and green steak and green milk and green eggs. Oh, what a green meal it shall be. What do you mean a green meal? Well, it's St. Patty's Day. You gotta eat a green meal. What do you mean you gotta eat a green meal? Well, you gotta eat a green meal on St. Patty's Day. That's what everybody does. People like drink and wear green? No, no, no. My family, we have a green meal. Very traditional. It's all about the green meal. I've already eaten. It is now the 18th here. I'm good at bed uh, after eight hours of work and six drinks. Damn. Hope you had a green meal. <laughs> and if you didn't have a green meal, watch out. The green groibler is going to get you. And if you're not careful, he's going to grab you and groibel at you. I don't know what that entails, but it's going to happen. Not eating your damn green eggs and ham? Why, why not? Eat my green eggs, eat my ham. You are weak if you don't want to eat my green eggs or my ham. If you don't want to eat my green eggs and ham, that just means you're weak. You're not strong enough to be able to devour the green eggs and ham. See, I think that uh, Sam I am should have gone on an elaborate, like, gaslighting trip. He should have, he should have grass lit him. He should have grass lit him hard. Bitch. I hit you. I hit your wings. Oh my god, fucking coward. I gotta run away, I gotta run away. It's fine, it's fine. It's a legitimate strategy in Fortnite. Oh, fuck you. Oh, son of a bitch. That's fine. Beautiful shot, by the way. Can I just say, beautiful shot into the fucking pumpy. They're putting me in the- they're putting me in the leagues with the better gamers, pretending that I am- I am- I am gamer enough for they. They're putting me in the leagues with the better gamers, saying that I am gamer enough for they. They're saying you're gamer enough, and I'm saying I'm not, I'm not gamer enough, no. Wish I twas, but I ain't. I had some banana bread with some green sprinkles. Does that count? Yeah, that counts. I had a banana today. That was my that was my lunch. I don't think I've eaten anything else. Like I had a banana, and that was it. And I might have a sandwich. But I think I've only had a banana today. I only had a banana today. Yeah, I only ate a banana today. Weird. I'll eat a sandwich later. I'll have a couple of say. I'll remember to eat food. I promise. <laughs> I'm pointing at the screen. Don't worry. I'll remember to eat food. I'll remember. Putting that in my fucking brain for later. N notating that down. Remember to eat food. Food yumby. Got it. Get picking around, Brendan. No, I'm trying to not do that. I'm trying to lose weight, not gain weight, dude. Come on, Brendan. Get picking around. Become orbulent. No. 
Trying to lose weight, dog. Trying to get down to 230, 220. And it'll happen. I just gotta keep, uh, keep working on it. Yo, that bunny got a dumpy? Oh, be pizza. Oh, pizza. Oh. Yeah, sorry, picked the fat ass skin. I apologize. Trying to get small and narrow. <laughs> Brendan, think about it. If you were small and narrow, you could fit into any cracks, Brendan. You could rob any bank, Brendan. You could squeeze through the slightest of cracks, Brendan. You could just flow under the atoms, Brendan. Imagine, Brendan. You could get through any crack. Think about it, Brendan. Funk on it. You could get through anything, Brendan. Just become as small as the basic building blocks of life, Brendan. It'll be epic, dude. It'll be awesome, dude. It'll be epic, dude. It'll be awesome, dude. My problem is I like to eat and I'm lazy. Uh, I also like to eat and I'm lazy. I'm just calorie counting now. That's it. I calorie count and I'm like, nope, don't go, bo don't go beyond this. And I lost like 13 pounds. So, it worky. It worky for me. I will, uh, continue to lose weight and keep, like, walking. But I'm, like, I'm 30. I gotta care about my health more. So, like, quit vaping. Trying to uh, maintain a diet. Uh, trying to maintain, like, a mantra. Trying to be, like, normal. Brendan, if you were putting a Fortnite to skin, what would be your pickaxe and back bling? I, everybody always asks me that, and I literally don't know. If I had, like, a pickaxe, it'd be... Oh, fuck. I don't know. A... Uh, Decapitated dog head was the first thing I thought of, and that's fucked up. Um. Oh, somebody fucking poached my sh- Oh, this is- Why the fuck would you drop it on restored reels? I want my shit. I want my shit. You took my shit. Yeah, I don't know. I- I, I genuinely- I have no idea. I don't know why I thought that. That was just a, that that just fucked up. That's the first thing that popped in my head. I was like, say something fucked up. I don't know. I haven't put serious. I'd have to put. It's something that I'd have to put serious thought into, and I haven't. You're the guy who stole my shit, right? For sure. Or shit, the guys who stole my shit. Got my shit back. A long Mountain Dew? Yeah, I don't I don't know what like my glider or like my back bling or pickaxe would be. I just don't I don't think about stuff like that. It's like whenever somebody asks me, Brendan, what would your character and character thing be? And I'm like stunlocked? Because I I genuinely don't know. I don't know. You see, you see, you see, it's Definitely something. I just... I, I don't know. I'll think about it. Your pickaxe would be your model and your glider would be your model, but why? <laughs> probably a... I, I probably like a flail with like a nondescript green can of soda. As the flail or like slime. So like slime in a canister at the end of a flail. And then back bling, probably a uh, screaming skull. Something simple. Maybe the void. Maybe a void back bling. That'd be pretty good. Just put the void in there. See what happened. Do a little voiding. Have a little void time. Big pizza surfboard for the glider? Yeah, me on a big, just a big slice of pizza coming all the way down to Tilted Towers on the big pizza. That is true. What a, what a true. What a decidedly true. T what? What? Anyway, what a true. What a decidedly true, true. I, uh. What? That was a moment. He 
Yeah, for a moment the world- What? It did it again. What? Why? You're in the other reality now. No, I'm back. It shifted again. Oh, don't worry. No, we're back. It shifted again. World just had a moment. Do you have to do specific amounts of damage to them, or do they just, do they just drop? Cloudberry, yummy. You got anything yummy around here? Oh, scrumpted leumptious. Hell yeah. Swap out the Zeus for that. Good bit. I'm in the Nixon verse now? No! No, 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 no. Don't put me in there. I don't want to be an analog horror. Don't you dare put me in analog horror. Don't you fucking dare. I swear to fucking God, if I wake up and there's VHS grain all over my face, like, oh, shit. The worm gerbler. He's here. Oh, no. Here's my 15-minute, uh, audio file about me screeching about the worm gerbler. We didn't know, we didn't know, we didn't know, we didn't know, we didn't know. Every analog horror would be like, we didn't know, 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 we didn't know. Well, why? Why didn't you just know, idiot? Why couldn't you just know better? You should've just known. If I was in analog horror, I would just know better. If I walk uh, down the street and I'm enjoying like a cool, refreshing, I don't know, hot dog or frankenfurter or something. I was, I was, I couldn't think of anything else. Um, if I was sipping on some nice lemonade walking down the street and I saw like a pothole, uh, and next to the pothole was a big Bugs Bunny-esque sign that said, open pothole for man-made horrors and cosmic horrors far beyond our comprehension. I'd just walk away. I'd just turn around and walk away. Go, no, thank you. I'd rather not. No, thank you. I always say, it's like if somebody tried to, like, offer a grand adventure to me. No, thank you. I ain't got time for that shit. I got responsibilities. I ain't got time for a grown-up adventure. Like, a fu do you want to go on a magical adventure? No, I ain't got time for that shit, Buster. I don't care, you wacky man. I ain't got time for that shit. You wouldn't even just peep the horror? I would never. Stare into these eyes. Are these the eyes of a man who would just peep into a horror? Are, they, are these the eyes of somebody who would just be like, yeah. Yeah, I'll look into the void. Yeah. I'll let all of it consume me. Are these the eyes of a man who would do that? No. Absolutely, I would never look directly into the, into the pouring and coursing void. I would never. No, I am the void. I am the fear. I don't worry about, like, peeping into the horror because I am the fear. I am the void. Why would I look at something with which I am already made of? Would you tell other people to peep the horror? No. That's a different guy's bit. Obviously not. I would try to uh, judiciously and gently say, hey, that's not my bit, dude. No, sorry, boy. Sorry, sorry, buddy. That's that's not my bit, dude. No, sorry, dude. Sorry. I, 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 I'd I love to be able to tell people to peep the horror, uh, great beast from the cosmos, but, like, that's not my bit, dude. It's just not my bit. The, the, the great horror from beyond the cosmos would be like, dude, what the fuck? But what if it was? Just do it anyway. It doesn't matter if it's not your bit. And I'd be like, sorry, man, it's not my bit. I'd be sitting there looking out into the great ocean, Dagon peering from the abyss, the depths below, as I there's the fish people surround me. They'll yell, peep the horror, peep the horror, peep the horror. And I will say, no, no, thank you, bud. It's not my bit. Not my time, not my place. That's a different guy. Not my bit, Buster. Gotta say a different bit. Is that Master Splinter in the car? 
Nice splinter. Does he know? You think he knows? He's gotta know, right? I don't think he knew. I don't think he knew. He didn't know. He was just chilling, driving a car. All out of ammo on everything. Oh, he 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 Somebody's like fucking trying to scalp that token over there, right? Somebody's definitely over there trying to like hide that token. Okay, they picked it up. Well, they die immediately, though, is the thing. Is somebody playing a little goof? Curios. Ah, oh, they took all the cars from here. Dude. Damn it. No driving. I love drive the car. I like get behind the wheel and drive the car. What the fuck, dude? A fucking island. Destroy this. You can do anything. Delete this. Delete this. This island? Delete that. You see that island? Delete that island. I want that Zeus. I want the Zeus medal. If I can get the Zeus medal, that'd be quite cool. I do hear a shooting over here. Interesting. Let me see. See if I can get a Zeus medal. Oh, is it two medallion fuckers fighting? Oh, shit. Okay. That was out of nowhere. Yeah, that's Fortnite. Yeah, that's Fortnite. Alright, well, I gotta win. I'm, I'm pretty happy. I got a crown royale, so... I'm gonna I'm gonna call it for the stream. My my yeah, that was that was that was so nasty. I gotta get offline. That was that was knowledge beyond uh, what was humanly capable of understanding. So we're gonna get off. Um, tomorrow hopefully normal streams will resume. Uh, we're gonna get back into some non Fortnite things. I'll figure it out. Uh, but thank y'all for coming to the stream. I appreciate it greatly. Uh, I, I will try to heal up and get a little better here. Uh, before I go, I'm going to shell as I always do. Uh, creator code Brent Daniel. If you buy anything on the Epic Games Store, it helps me out a ton. If you don't use the Epic Games Store, don't worry about it. There's always videos over on Brent Daniel too. You can check those out at your leisure. Hope you all have a good morning, noon, or night, wherever you are out there in the world. And if I see you tomorrow, I'll see you tomorrow. We'll try to figure out something fun and weird to do. So, bye-bye.